Touche, touche. All right, man, we in this bitch. We in this bitch. Scoop don't want to be here today, y'all. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm talking about him. He can roll up on camera. He ain't got the mic in front of him. Nigga saying pause about eating cake, but we... Twisted Tea was the drink of choice when you went to the store, G. I ain't buy this. Ain't no liquor stores open. You know this. You got a good Sunday. point, nigga. I get that. That's man. some real alcoholic Sunday. shit right there. I got to get that alcohol <laughs> some kind of way. That if they put it in sweet <laughs> tea, that shit is supposed to go with soul food. I don't even like tea. I ain't going to hold you. You don't like you don't tea. Like tea. They right. kicked you out of Mississippi. You they didn't did. Leave. <laughs> they they kicked you out of Mississippi. <laughs> no, they everybody right. love that ain't, that ain't the only thing like, that he be doing. He be, it's a lot of shit that he don't do. That niggas. They got to be like the peach South tea, tea, I buy at least one <laughs> gallon of sweet tea probably at least every two weeks. That's my mama them though for that sure. That Milo's unsweet. They go to uh, Can- my mama go to Canes and shit. Then I don't want to go to Canes. Then she bust it down after she buy from Canes. Type shit. So then you, ain't, no you ain't like it when they put it out in the sun and shit. I, I mean, I done call. drunk tea. It's just not my. I'm not gonna buy. I'm, if I go to the store, it's I'm some never shit gonna you buy just it. gotta have tea. Yeah, with. Thanksgiving have dinner, dinner you need at least one glass of tea. With yeah, yeah, I ain't mad at that. Christmas, for sure, for sure. Family reunion. I drink tea when I gotta come to the studio with though. Yeah, sometimes you need some stuff, but it's three ingredients: water, tea, sugar. It's that's easy. That it's easy. simple. Hella. They can't fuck up. Yeah, hell of sugar now. Hell I sugar. get sugar free, which is kind of like great value sugar. It's still sugar, but they want to pretend that it ain't. So okay. it helped me sleep better at night. <laughs> because stress will kill you quicker than having sugar will. This it's is a, a science to this it's shit. It's a fact, though. Hell yeah. It's a science to this shit. Nah, for real, right having now. sugar and consuming a lot of sugar, then stressing about consuming a lot of sugar will kill you much quicker than just thinking just you having ain't it. having sugar. <laughs> Even though you having sugar. <laughs> Even though you having sugar. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm I'm fucking up on my health factor, but on my mental stress factor. I'm great. Oh, I'm proficient. I'm, I'm great. I'm proficient. <laughs> I'm very efficient in that. Yeah, yeah. You can't beat every. Uh, you can't beat everybody. You got to fight the battles you can fight well. <laughs> That's just what it is. <laughs> That's real shit. Fight the battles. Oh, you come can on, fight man. Clap it up, man. Yeah, yeah. Niggas ain't doing nothing. Clap it up, man. Clap it up. 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 Come on, man. So what you're saying is Pod bitch <laughs> Scoop My bass. favorite part y'all Scoop hey. bass G Yeah yeah I smoke it I just uh, can't roll it No I'm saying That's who did it I know we are, hey, You the real nigga In your relationship <laughs> <laughs> You are the real nigga In your relationship We got We got Reggie here Big Reggie What up my boy Man what up Comedian Comedian My boy the hey, man, I'm just a funny motherfucker that be cooking this shit, man. That's the all chef, the comedian. My boy, my boy, just Reggie bro. and his bitch. Hell we got yeah. my boy Dalton in here. We got Sus in here. What's that, that dog? Queasy. We got Queasy on the board. Queasy on the board. It's been a minute, man. Blessed uh, hands. Queasy on the board. I, I don't even remember the man no more. Hey. Hey, shout Reggie. out to Ma. I don't worry about all that, but shout out to Ma. On the way, on the way. It's on the way like Bass Record. But hey yeah, man, man. So sh- real quick We're gonna do it at the end too But shout out your Instagram right now Let's get that out the way, Reggie Alright man, look me up At Just Reggie Comedy If you wanna laugh See some of my crazy ass Fucking skits or whatnot Can I cuss excessively? You can cuss excessively You can do what you Just making sure And yeah, you wanna see some good ass food Shit that fuck bitch ass asshole ass hungry. It's gonna make you hungry as hell Two things you gonna Good ass fried wings. chicken, bro You gonna good have ass a song chicken, that bro. make you horny and you're going to have some food that's going to make you hungry. And I say, what goes the better? What's better? What's better than that? The two H's. If you that's hit a whole nice the triple H. Shout out to C. Rich. <laughs> Shout out to C. Rich. And, and when I hear that joke, one of my favorite jokes she tell. The triple H. Nigga, homeless hidden holes. Oh, man. You can do that so many different ways. Homeless hidden holes. <laughs> There's a lot of niggas out here be homeless. That's a real thing. Be hitting hoes. That's hey, a real hey, thing. My nigga, uh, my nigga Wallow. My nigga say, uh, Couch Warriors. Yeah. Warriors. A, uh, what you mean? Hobo sexuals. Hobo Yeah, that's what I know. Hobo sexuals. Ho- hobo sexuals. That's the thing. Yeah, niggas. Hey, when you ain't got nowhere to live, you definitely will fuck better. <laughs> I've been homeless before and I wanted to stay the night. Yeah. Well, I pulled out all the dick tricks. I, I've been there before. You got to pull out all the dick tricks. You, you got to start using your hips a lot. 
You gotta do a lot of shit because sometimes <laughs> that dick will disagree with you. The head be ready, but the shaft just not ready to perform. So you gotta manipulate it. <laughs> so you gotta manipulate. You start yeah. thinking about other shit. I fuck next to a box of Krispy Kreme. If I can't get stimulated that way, God don't want me fucking you, man. <laughs> God don't want me fucking. You. <laughs> what the fuck bro? That nigga said shit That Krispy Kreme Gonna do it for real I got it I got it women cheat call You want that bitch nigga To eat your pussy better Put a Krispy Kreme Down there right on your belly button <laughs> Tell him he can't get it <laughs> Until I right, Until it <laughs> Until I get it <laughs> Until he finish He said watch He said watch, said watch. That's You a, gonna look <laughs> That's a different type of beat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy. You gonna look down and they gonna be slurping on your uterus. You don't know what the fuck is happening. Nigga think a baby coming out that bitch. That nigga is <laughs> that nigga is tickling my core values. <laughs> oh, this nigga is in my thoughts. <laughs> that nigga said put a Krispy Kreme right below it today. We we'll watch what he do. <laughs> watch what he do. Like dangling the carrot in front of him. Yeah, yeah. Him. And everybody got an addiction. Some niggas is a blunt. Some niggas been to prison. It's a pack of noodles. You need to find out what speaks to that nigga. That's a fact, though. For real. You ain't lying, though. No Hell bullshit, yeah. though. No you could be a slavery nigga. Put a gate. Open that bitch. Have a little portrait of a gate. And like the gate is open. That's all that nigga ever wanted to do was walk through an open Running gate. Running through that bitch. Nigga gonna devour your shit. This. That probably worked for women too on what? Hell yeah. Women suck That's dick why better I when they angry. Put, put a oh, for sure, for sure. When they angry? Or, or, the, or the guilty shit. <laughs> when she want to prove why she the bitch you need to... But she got to have a little bit of pick me in. Just a little bit. Not a lot. But just a little bit of pick me in. For her sure. For to sure. make her want to prove herself. That's yeah. why I say cheating... When a woman cheat, it's so much. The nigga she cheated with, that's why niggas kill niggas. Because yeah. they know who her, who that woman is. She suck dick better. When, when a woman cheat... She swallowing everything. Oh my life. She be down there on the edge of your gooch. When she cheat. Look, look, look at his ass. Like he women <laughs> ride dick longer when they cheat. <laughs> oh, she been fucking you for three years. She ride, you know her time. Six oh, minutes, 13 so. seconds. That's all she got. In there After that, her check engine like, come on. Me, Ooh, well, 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 cheat and like she got something to prove. <laughs> that nigga, that man, she'll make you bust in one position. <laughs> I ain't lying to you. I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> this is facts, though. That bitch make Henny dick come in two seconds when they want to. <laughs> and that and that motherfucker stay in rock all really? night long. Women are powerful. Oh. Women use their full power, like they max potential. Nigga would be in the shower for good. crying. You said for good. Huh? And if they'll be, for they'll good. be in the. We'll be in the shower crying. They got everything it takes to break us down to nothing. They know all our business. Say like she clean your drawers, my nigga. You better not have an off day. <laughs> not the internet calling you little shitty smitty. <laughs> little shitty. So you had one off day for the rest of your existence on social <laughs> media. You will be known as shitty smitty. And she got all the information she to break you that way. That's just one thing. She yeah, they the took a picture. Of that. She got the screenshot already. Women evil. I <laughs> think grabbing I my dick me. on soft is an act of evil. Yeah, I don't like that shit either. Let, hey, let hey, grab around my stomach. Let me prep. Let me first. get right. You feel me? Rub my leg. That's all you gotta do is rub my. It might shit. be a bad. It might be a bad blood flow day. <laughs> you might have ate a Mac double. You might have ate a Mac double and jacked off that morning. That blood ain't gonna go there the same. <laughs> that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just so for hey, real. Hey, don't lie, don't man, lie. Man, uh, man, a real, man, a real, man. real honest moment. When I was, when I was a shorty, when I was a shorty, you know what I'm saying. Before I do what, what I do, I used to hate when, when, when them little when girls try to you know, try to grab my dick, and I'd be like, "Bro, I ain't even hard. What you doing, like, damn it?" Yeah, but. After a while, when you get older, be like, I don't give a fuck. I don't give yeah, a fuck. You grow in yeah, don't yeah. give a fuck. <laughs> well, yeah, hey, grab this motherfucker. We in a grocery store, grab it. Let me, we can go yeah, bust yeah. down in the bathroom or something. I'd rather grab that in my ass. Like, I got all these Bro, they, they, grab they, That's ass. all they want to do. <laughs> like, what the that's fuck? Why y'all be saying be too tottering on that gay shit? That's all they want to do. And we not speaking against anybody yeah, who's yeah, gay yeah, if that's what you choose. We love to let a community This is an individual preference. When I. Think of my ass, I see it as an yeah, it's, it's regular. And that's it. Like, yeah. I shit too hard and I feel like <laughs> I need to go dab some pussy behind my ear. Because it's a pain and the area ain't supposed to be no pain. 
<laughs> and I always find myself thinking like, damn, they are really the Avengers. <laughs> they are the Bro, Avengers. Look, I'll try pause, pause, pause. <laughs> Yeah, one day, bro, I seen some shit, bro. I was thinking, like, ain't no motherfucking way, bro. So we think we tough. We think we are tough. We That's walk true. in the world every hey, day, bro. hopping in F one fifties and Yukons and wearing square toe boots, getting, and taking and a dick. Glocks, thinking we strong, taking a dick, niggas. Is and this a nigga <laughs> sleeping on pink fur in a twin size bed. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga just took twelve inches, <laughs> like it was nothing. <laughs> That nigga is an Avenger. <laughs> that nigga is an Avenger. He got a job Avenger. where they walk all day. Got to get ran through. That shit nuts, bro. That's a that's an Avenger. That's crazy. And this is just the ignorant side of the um. This is what we talking about here. This the ignorant side. Yeah, this ain't that specific. This ain't but this ain't supposed truth. to be educational, but it's the truth. I swear to God, I thought like, about that shit one time. Like, I don't understand it, bro. Like, <laughs> I swear to God, because I, I be wiping my, I clean my that. ass. I be like, fuck, so I can't even. After you take that big shit and that one log come out, it's kind of big. You like, be like, bro, your ass like, really hurt, bro. You, oh you got to go sit bro. down for a little bit. That ain't even the worst <laughs> one. You thinking big log, bro. That's the pain. Eat the wrong cut of steak and go shit. <laughs> and it gets a pebble this big. And it felt like an F-150 just drove out of your ass. <laughs> That's the one that get me. I see the, I see, you know what I'm saying? It felt like it was big too. <laughs> Boy, that's what it you got, get up man. and you look, you be like, I almost ain't no do it. Way. Ask me some cigarettes. It one felt time. like it, it, was it felt so like it was bad. this. It, it felt like a damn so baseball. <laughs> it was so bad. I didn't go see like, that big phone. No bullshit, bro. No bullshit. You ever took a hard shit and you end up cleaning your whole apartment because you can't go sit down right there? <laughs> like I can't go sit down right now. Oh. <laughs> 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 you gotta walk around, <laughs> and that shit rough. I swear to God, you bro. know it's rough. You find yourself nigga. doing shit you never do. You on the toilet seat trying to spread your. Oh, my mama is spreading the toilet seat. <laughs> Hey, for a little ass pebble to come out, fuck, I swear to God, bro, I swear to like, God, nigga. This by our older listeners who go through this shit, I over 35. Bro, this is real shit. For real, bro. niggas. And, kids, and, and niggas be going crazy. I be thinking the hard, like, it's too much for me, bro. I seen a nigga Jack in the Box was eating four of them Jack in the Box tacos, a jumbo Jack and some shit. I chiro. never eat a Jack in the Box. I said, nigga, why are you so angry at your bathroom? <laughs> Like what did your bathroom do? Oh, I you? never eat no Jack in the Box taco, bro. I'm not even eating Jack in the Box. I stopped talking to a girl if I see her eating some Jack in the Box. Yeah, I think I probably would. Too. Hey, hey, side like track. that shit gotta be the well, last. I seen them make it, bro. It's say, powder. Bro. Side track, real nigga quick. Said, side track. Nigga so you, said, you from you from originally from Mississippi? Spend a lot of time. Spend a lot of time in Texas, right? Yep. Let me know real quick. Another side segue. Mm-hmm. What part of Mississippi? I'm from Prentice, a little small town. Oh, you from Prentice? Yeah, I'm from Prentice. Oh, you right down the road? Yeah, I'm from the JDC. Hell oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. That's right down the road. Right down the road. Right I'm from Summerall. Yeah, go to jail. That's when niggas go to Hattiesburg, you got to make a decision. Am I going to take the Summerall yeah, route? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And take yeah. a risk at a roadblock? Or I'm going to go through Bassfield? Go to... That's an extra 18 minutes. Oh, my life. Summerall is that bad. And it's literally a split in it's, the road. It's, it's all way, and it's two of them. It's one on uh, what is it? Is it five eighty nine? Right by that little gas station. I've right been there. gone too long to no roads. I just <laughs> know right up. There used to be a big house on the little one. Yeah, My yeah. Daddy friend that that Glenn ass. Russell. That's yeah, Glenn yeah, yeah. Russell's house. Yeah. He's, that when I know I'm passing that house, now I know the roadblock is either gonna be if I go around t- round to that, town to the right, to the yeah, right, to the right. To, that's where the gas station. Or if I go through is. town to, and keep straight ahead. Yeah, yeah, that's where the gas station is to the right. That's that's. Going to Hattiesburg, you know where we come from. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. Hell yeah. You right live there. in a dangerous ass town. You know, bro, right. but he, he, knew he, knew he knew everybody, oh. though. I, I I used to be everywhere, though. I'm he knew everywhere. everybody, though. Yeah, I was everywhere. But, yeah, bro. Mississippi, you got to be everywhere. To, you to, to, in your town. You ain't going to learn shit. You ain't going to learn shit at all, bro. To divert back, with you not being from here, we had a conversation about burgers, right? Mm-hmm. Now, it got to be a fast food restaurant. And we'll qualify as a fast food restaurant if it has a drive through I right? feel like you're going to say Whataburger is your top choice, ain't you? No, no, no. Is it yours? Is it Hell true? no. It Man, listen, my, niggas was telling my top five. Niggas, thank you. Nigga was thank you. I'm going to tell you the truth. The thank best you, burger bro. you can get fast food and it suck because they fucking over us. This is one of my jokes I tell on stage. 
That Junior Bacon Cheeseburger, if that bitch could just be a little bit bigger from Wendy's, <laughs> nigga, that bitch is tough. That bitch tough. It's just little. If that bitch lose one more ounce, I'm going to the, I'm writing a letter to the chairman. Because we got to talk about this. Hey, like, did y'all see Chipotle, uh, nigga, said he going to give out bigger, bigger portions? portions? Yeah, Because yeah, niggas complain. All y'all do is When I first moved here, nigga, Chipotle bags was breaking. Honestly, you used to see so many yeah, posts, yeah, yeah. yeah like the shit that was in it will leak out and leak in the bag. That shit fall on the ground. That used to be their problem. Nice. Nah, now, too less. Now it's Benny Hanna portions. So, so tell me your top five fast food restaurant burger joints. Listen, we, I'm glad niggas said though it's not what it's not even top five. five. Niggas is not even top yeah, five. You saying what we said that conversation him, yesterday? No, nah, it was him and T Step. Yeah. Him T Step and uh and uh. And uh, what's his, what's the other name? name? But like, Jer- Jeremy. Jeremy, I told you it's a biased opinion. He from opinion Texas too. Yeah, they all like it because they from Texas. That's they what I said, said, bro. Period. Fuck out of here. Look at him. Let me turn the mic on. Turn that shit. <laughs> <on>. <laughs> Cut the mic. <laughs> Top five fast food restaurant burger joints. It gotta have a drive through. They gotta have a drive through though. Yeah. Gotta have a drive through to qualify. Hmm, Texas. I can't even think of five places I get. Bro. Okay, okay. For me, number one <laughs> is In and Out. Okay. okay, that's my man said. In and out, I want a double double. No, actually, I want a three by three with no lettuce, no tomatoes. <laughs> that's a big ass burger. Split. That's not a big ass burger. You thinking it is, but you just ain't had the right amount of hunger yet. That's not a big ass burger. That's not a big ass burger. Like it's hunger spikes that you reach. You just ain't you. You still slim, so you ain't got there you ain't yet. got there yet. See, I got my first real hunger strike. I got the crack level hunger strike first. <laughs> like I fell in love with food first bite. <laughs> first and we've been in a toxic relationship ever since. <laughs> so that's why I say in and out. You gotta get the three by three with the extra spread, only grilled onions, add chopped chilies, no lettuce, no tomato. Extra spread. For extra sure. pickles, but on the side. Yeah. That's a real order. That's more number one. Number two is that Wendy's Junior Bacon Cheeseburger. I got a cheat code for that bitch too. Get the Texas Double Stack and have them dress it like a Junior Bacon Cheeseburger. Oh, I'm sure. They already yeah, got a bacon yeah. double stack. Yeah. That bitch is more expensive, but it's the, well, it's the times we in now. You get more That's number calls. two. Number three. This, this is in order. This is in order. All right. Number three. Hmm. They got to be around right now. No, it went oh, just of all time. Oh, yo, 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 five, nigga. That original Whopper ad cheese from the nineties just hit different. I don't know what the fuck. That, I don't know what crackhead they sold Burger King to, and how they fucked up the recipe. I ain't gonna lie, to Burger King. But in the nineties, Whopper used to be. They had that mayo mixed in with that lettuce. Like he had mayo on every lettuce. <laughs> On every lettuce, it was mayonnaise on that bitch. Now, they give an uneven, <laughs> uncomfortable amount. One side of your burger is mayo. May- there's no mayonnaise, no lettuce. The other side, it is a clump of mayonnaise that makes you so uncomfortable. That's that undercover brother. Yeah, you can't. I can't. If you can't distribute condiments on food properly, you shouldn't be able to serve food. Don't eat the mayonnaise. You bro. shouldn't be able to serve food. You ever had Culver's? Clovers Hold on, hold on. Oh, he got, he got See, I was just trying to make sure Because we naming a bunch of shit He ain't had a bunch of shit He got two more I'm gonna get there I'm gonna get there I'm gonna get there, I'm gonna get there. Get there. Hey, get there. Hey, If you haven't had Culver's You, you should try No, 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 hold on Oh, yeah, most definitely yeah. Give me all the Nigga, give me so all the So you haven't had Culver's I haven't had Culver's I haven't had Grips People are talking about You haven't had Grips I haven't had Grips I ain't had Grips either And I wanted to go Yeah, I'm a low maintenance nigga I tell you, that Junior Bacon Cheeseburger It's right by the crib It's like a mile away It's right I don't need much else <laughs> when you happy, you don't teeter totter. You right, you right. All right, last two, last two, last two. Last two. And they gotta have a drive through. Gotta have yeah, a drive through. What just if for, I don't know if they have a drive through or not? Because it's a place in in Mesquite, I believe, off Galloway called Dunn Burgers. Them bitches are fighting. I'm see but I'm not sure drive. if they have a drive through or not. I'm gonna see. But if not, we are gonna just say them yeah. honorable mention. Honorable mention, Don's number Burgers. four. Don's Burgers. Uncle, nobody say that double cheeseburger from McDonald's off the little three two fifty nine menu. It don't matter if the cheese don't matter. It don't matter. You're gonna always crave one as long as you don't if you had one at some you got, point you in your life, put the you fries don't on crave it. one. You gotta put the fries on it. I don't do that, but I don't play with my food like that. Don't put cause then if I take some food away, I'm gonna have to get an extra fry. <laughs> 
Cause I can't manipulate. I can't manipulate my fat like that. Cause now if I take some fries off my out my oh pack my and put so it on my burger, my I'm missing fries. Missing even fries. though I'm still eating fries. <laughs> like fat got it on its own science. I'm touché, sorry. Touché. It got its own science. Touché. So that's why we don't put fries and shit. Like I can't even eat on the way home. Real shit For real Like if I eat on Cause that's why You gotta stay up ahead Like say if I go somewhere And I get a combo I'm gonna get a double cheeseburger For the drive home Cause <laughs> Oh you gonna get two Yeah, yeah I'm gonna get a little, Just a little something extra Like if I get a Big Mac I'm gonna get a double cheeseburger To eat on the way home Or okay, a single okay, meat okay, cheeseburger okay, okay. Just something to manipulate My fat to have patience The food is almost here Because <laughs> if you eat it in the car no, the By the time there. you get in the house <laughs> No, 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 no. You You get home, you hungry. <laughs> you gotta listen to the ending. You gotta listen to the ending first. Cause when you get home and you get in your place to com- your place of comfort, your mind thinks I, ain't I need to eat something. I ain't eating nothing. Like it's just yeah, it's a cycle. Like it's like when, you, it's I, like when you walk in the house, you started, yeah. You ain't have to pee until you walk when, into yeah, the house. Yeah, yeah. You come from a spot, you leave the club or a late night spot. Your mind is I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna eat. If you eat in the car, you're going to get up in the middle of the night and eat something. I don't give a fuck how full you think you is. One thing I can't do is, I'm gonna think about is that eat something on the way to the crib. And then if I get like, like say for I got a significant other and she eating like her food now. Mm-hmm. Now I'm gone. You supposed to be eating something. I'm like, <laughs> you supposed to be eating something. I'm like, damn, let me get some. Like next time eat a pussy. Watch you eat. <laughs> That's two of her happiest things at one time. That's like cleaning your ears and that getting nigga some nigga head. Crazy. I can't do it. I would never yes, try you that. Can. Because the way I clean my ear, I close my eye, my toes start to curl. You be making noises and shit. Nah, a woman gave you shit. Start to roll if you shit. got some head while you clean your ears, bro, you that shit get that probably woman death. I'll probably die. I'll probably, probably, probably die. die. You will not want to die. It don't I'll get probably, no greater. I'll probably die. It don't get no greater than that. I'll probably die. I wouldn't be able to hold something. Like I have to stop. Now that that's a scary part of life to be in. That's how I got this night. Or she I had stop. to hold it. I ain't know if I was gonna fart or shit. That boy <laughs> will give me some head, and my my damn stomach started doing this wave thing. I'm like, what's happening? I never new new level unlocked. I didn't even know about this head. Nobody warned me. My daddy didn't tell me about this. This bitch just threw off my whole equilibrium. Like I don't know what's happening, <laughs> and I feel something sitting on the crater of my ass, and I didn't know what it was. So I held it in till I and I nutted and still held it and. Next day I had this nut. <laughs> Next day I had this nut. Oh my oh god, man. bro. That's fucked up, ain't it? <laughs> That's a dangerous game. That's a you know what? Game. I'm not I'm not letting it That's bitch called putting them. pussy on the pedal. I supposed to shit at a party. Whatever my body did naturally is what I should have done, and she supposed to understood me. <laughs> She supposed to understood me whatever I naturally did because when they fart, they be sneaking them in between them quicks be some ass fart. Oh, for sure. But when your mind focus on pussy, your, your nose stop working. You know some of the funniest <laughs> shit ever that <laughs> for real? I experienced in, in the, like like the most prissiest person I ever had to never shit in front of me, never burped in front of me, never did nothing in front of me. Like, he just was like, Ew, I can't do it. My mama did raise me like that. So right in the bed sleep and she let out a big ass fart. Oh, I was like. Did you judge her? I said, hey, wake up. You woke that woman up out of I her woke sleep up. and she farted while she was 85% I dead? I woke up, I woke up. <laughs> I woke you are, up. Uh, you are unhinged. I woke up, I said, I said, hey, I just need to let her know that you weren't so pretty no more. I said, hey, you just let out a crazy fart. Crazy. I peed in a bitch bed before. Like, what I'm supposed to do? I'm 85 percent dead. I don't know what you uh, want me to I mean, do. Here. Listen, doing some head. I'm sleep no, drunk. Sleep. No, no, no. I'm saying I'm sleep drunk. Like sleep drunk, and I already the bus slept. All that shit. So she tried to do it again. Boom, boom, boom. And me half sleep, super drunk. I, I'm. I don't know if this. You pissed on me? Nah, nah, she was. Nah, what you mean? You don't know if it pissed? Did you squirt? I was. I didn't know if it was. I ain't know. No, no. What I was, I don't know. Well, no, no. I, I knew what it was. I'm saying I don't know what was about to happen. I'm yeah. not sure if I was about to nut if I was about to piss. So I was just like, "Fuck it, I'm about to let it ride." And it, it hey, let, and it was all piss. I was like, "Oh shit, my bad." Did like she catch you right before you piss, right before huh? you pee in the morning. If you, you can hold moment. yourself together, oh, a lot of you. Oh, it's yeah. a whole new world out man. there. But uh man. The shit you learn when you grown. Like, I, I, I wish I would have waited to start fucking when I was grown. When really? you start fucking? Like I start oh, I I don't want to go that deep into it, but you start I, mean, I started like fucking nine. early. Like my eight. sexual peak was intrigued very early. I went fucking at eight, nigga. Hell no. I was Ten. still got 
Like 11, 12. I mean, yeah, that's normal. Yeah, 11, 12. Yeah. I, I, lost, Mississippi. I, lost my Mississippi. I lost my virginity at 11, but I didn't fuck or start fucking again until 13. So, like. I, I just started fucking good. I don't know about most people. I tell the truth. I just started. Like, I, because you you as a youth, you think <laughs> I just got enough. Like, I just got enough. For a long time, you think like that. And it's some shit you think. That your girl is enjoying it and you think the noise is in the loud and the excitement. That's just her having the excitement of sex. Like a part her compassionate yeah. part of her body is intrigued. When you fucking her and she ain't making no sounds, but her face is so loud. Nigga, now she's enjoying sex. Women mm-hmm. don't even get to enjoy sex as much as us. Mm-hmm. And that's crazy because they can orgasm more than us, but they don't get to enjoy it more than us. When that motherfucker do that 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 scream where they ain't screaming, but they no, when she look back at you, when she look back at you and say that, what you doing? <laughs> hey, D Baz, you ever had one look back at you with that with them eyes and be like, what you doing to me? Bitch, you know oh what's happening? <laughs> Shit. You know what's happening. Oh my God. I get them, I got it the best of now. I done made it a whole trick. I go belly down initially. <laughs> but nigga, when I let the convertible back, shit. That's, that's when I get that look back like, what you doing to me? And that little tremble in their voice. Oh, what the? What you doing to me? Well, that bitch can't say no words and she just, oh, 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 oh. that drag. You in that spot, don't move. And that's where niggas fuck up because no, they fact. fucking for them. Nigga, fuck for her. Oh, my goodness, don't bro. slow down. Don't go fast. Just stay right where you at. Niggas uh-huh. get excited and fuck it up for her. Women I, lose more nuts than they catch. I learned that at a, that's at a, hilarious. <laughs> that's the that's truth. Hilarious. I learned that a couple years ago. Yeah, he was that's crazy. the truth. Yeah, he was crazy. <laughs> but it's a fact though. I didn't, definitely didn't see the facial that. expression. Women lose Bro, more no, nuts than they catch because a nigga is doing it for them. I tell Listen, a motherfucker. What I quick. figured out, bro, I I get it when if Shorty on top. I get it. You know what I'm saying? You know you get the motion. Woo, woo. But then you know when they start feeling good, they try to stay in that spot too. Yeah. I'm going to just stay in that spot. Mm-hmm. So I'll be like, I'll motherfucking Yeah, but you'll put around in there too though. though. You no, can't yeah, stay in that spot too long. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, That's yeah, the most of yeah. hey, that it woman on top, you ever had a one come down? Oh, and yeah. you didn't feel it as if she was coming down. But when she got ready to go back up, Bitch, if you move another inch, yes, nigga, this, bitch about this to shit is over. It's over with. <laughs> when you get, when you, hey, bro, when you line your time up wrong, nigga, that's a hurtful feeling. When you know this shit over, when you have accepted defeat, it's over. With. Sometimes you know bro, I've been there plenty. Uh, I've been, nigga, I've been there a lot of the time. I've been there plenty. I be like, the, that's because you still fucking for you. You got no, 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 no. I left the air girl left can't get alone. cracked like that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh no, exactly, exactly, exactly. Some of them might have fucking for me. Yeah, for sure. For oh yeah, sure. a, lot, a lot of them might have fucking for me. Honestly, well, when I was on that, yeah, motherfucker <laughs> be crazy. Let me, let me you, that's what I'm saying. Nigga be like, why she so crazy? Nigga, you fucked her crazy. No bullshit. Though. Y'all doing six right. positions three days a week. I'm knocking shit loose though. You Man, are school making said, love. Who said he ain't? He ain't knocking. Your shit loose though off the first. I'm not gonna. Hell no, nah, you better put only half the dick in. You don't know her yet. You oh, don't know her God. credit score. I got <laughs> You don't know her employment status. What that mean though? Oh, that mean everything. I ain't about to nut it. I ain't about to. Yeah. Yes, you do. I ain't you about to Your dick got a value on it. And what you put it in rates oh, your value. Look, yeah. if you put that in a bunch of nothing, listen, listen, you listen, might listen. have got something out of it, but you got nothing from her. Oh, I mean, like, I'm a saying, woman like, is a natural nurturer. I'm saying, so every chick ain't getting that, though. You can at least learn something. Oh, yeah, yeah, this yeah, bitch yeah. put dry ranch in her hamburger helper. From a hoe, you can at least learn something. <laughs> a bitch you can't learn nothing from? Sir, you should not be fucking her. No, I'm saying. Even the same was, for a woman. Even the ones that you are, even a, like, because we know the difference between the hoes and the, you know what I'm saying, now. So I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Not no more. I yeah, will. Stay in Cardi B, done fuck the game. I don't know who who anymore. Because they are. Women getting cracked at work, got husbands at work. That's been going and that's, on. I mean, been going on, but now it's a trend. Now they tell on themselves they so comfortable. That's social media. Social media be fucking up a lot of niggas. No, I'm just playing though. I do know the difference between a woman and her. The truth is, they all got both of them in them. You just gotta know which one is got, exposing yeah, themselves yeah, yeah, at the moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, they y'all, gotta I know like which one they get in the, the bedroom room. and show me your mama raised a hoe. <laughs> I mean, I want you to be. I don't do the spit play, spitting in people. My, you spit in my mouth. 
We can nah. fight, and I ain't gonna spit in no woman's mouth. I ain't got the best dental history. I don't think that's the right thing for me to do. I just spit in a woman's mouth. But oh my god! I, don't I mean, to each his own. Like you, know, you, you waking up fucking spinning somebody's mouth. You ain't washed your mouth out of a bottle of water. That's these niggas. They talking about they that waking is up horrible. Fucking right off the rip. I can't even. Bro. Some people like funky, not funky, but like. You know what? I'm gonna tell you something. I did experience one time, like what people said, the natural smell of a woman. Yes. You get so used to not smelling nothing, but a woman who got a little hair on that coochie, it got this different flavor. It's like it's like going to wing stars, a different flavor. You know, so you might be <laughs> lemon pepper all the time, but now you done got a hit of this garlic parmesan. That shit is not real. <laughs> and this bro. shit is amazing. <laughs> Being clean, like for real. freshly clean every time. Yeah, Hell, that shit, that like, but there's some real. women out there got great pH balance that can wear white drawers all day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> every girl can't wear white this drawers all day. This is a fact. Them bitches will be the color of a. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a break, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come oh on. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh my Everybody goodness. can't do that. Everybody got to line up with people. You, most people think you're not lining up with somebody like Listen, you. Listen, know, they you say know. that's a scientific thing, though. Like, what? The smell. That's why I say like being clean all the time ain't the thing. What you like, mean? Match, your what's smell. What's like, a smell is a big part of attraction to people. <laughs> yeah. That's why even like, even if you, you smelling her fresh or y'all smelling all this Y'all smelling all this non-natural shit yeah. that smell good. Just because you y'all ain't really smelling all, they don't each mean other. It, stink. it have a natural smell. Yeah, yeah, natural body like body. when I first started getting pussy, <laughs> it only had one scent. He said it was either strong, mild, or just right. <laughs> now nah, they got you, are we all them didn't, things. It didn't stink. We fingered a girl yeah. that you don't let everybody smell it. It didn't stink, That's but it just had was a smell. A smell. Yeah, I don't a, know what the fuck kind of curse waxing pussy is doing to these women. <laughs> It don't smell like nothing, and we've been nothing. trained so long to think that's a good thing. I want my pussy to smell like pussy. If I eat roast beef, I don't want it to smell like tacos. <laughs> <laughs> I want the pussy to smell like pussy. Stop putting yeah. all these oh pheromones God. and putting all these goddamn exactly. um, scents and hey, look. all this shit. Don't put none of that bath and body work shit on that pussy. No, no cherry blossom. None, none of that. that pussy going to bump none up like a caprice. Yes. <laughs> That pussy gonna bump up. I'm, that pussy I'm gonna not, have some rust on it. I'm not fucking with that. Mm-hmm. That's like it's like buying an old car, bro. You, like you hey, just you painted it. So so like, no, we so I want to see. As I need to see everything. Was amazing. Like yeah, it right. ain't nothing more beautiful than a wax pussy the same day she leave. But just for health purposes, and man, still you ain't supposed to touch that pussy kind of old up a little bit. Because her largest pores is in her vagina. That's how you transfer bacteria. You're supposed to wait 48 hours after a waxing. But if she don't but know, wait, you know, the, it looks so, it's hard. <laughs> Nigga, you so, ain't waiting for eight hours. Leave, you ain't waiting for eight hours. Wait, hell no, when she hell leave, no. if she okay, if she want me to wait, I wait. But you'll throw that pH wait. balance off like a motherfucker though. So if you got, if she get waxed, you need oh, to go that, shave your shit too. Pussy gonna throw the pH. Yeah, balance yeah, none of the pussy throw the pH balance. Yeah, everything throw that motherfucker. That's why I told bitch like everything gonna throw. It's like a car, bitch. Go get some maintenance done. She can't get no soda. Blaming that shit on me. You better go get a what they call what they call them bitch a yoni steam. You better go get. The yoni no, don't even do that. It's natural shit you can do. Vinegar, water. Yeah. Stop putting soap on that motherfucker. Stop. <laughs> vinegar. I'm just saying, white vinegar. You ain't dead. You ain't. You ain't putting it on the towel. towel. Put it That's in the water. Yeah, just put a little bit of water. water. Take back. A little teaspoon. <laughs> They can't do pussy maintenance because they take they don't take baths no more. They take showers they take all showers. the time. I, listen, taking a bath is crazy though. Taking a bath is crazy though. You well, you supposed to shower. Now that you grown, you supposed to shower once, sit down in the water, or reverse. get up, shower I, I, again. I would sit down and then shower after or reverse. When I when I take a bath, I take a bath and then I'm gonna let the water drain down. Take a shower. Yeah, yeah for sure. Yes. I ain't taking gonna, a I ain't, bath is some demasculating shit, but I gotta do it. I, gotta, I need it. I don't, give I don't think it's because demasculating. Because if you don't know how, to wa- how hot the water is, and we got nuts, they sensitive, so we dibble our yeah, ass yeah, in first. Yeah, yeah, That's the shit, part sure. that I did. Well, I put my foot in first. That's the, yeah, I'm definitely your foot don't right there. Your foot in your nuts but gets two different I, things. I, 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 my <laughs> foot can, be, it can take some heat that my nuts can't take. No, no, this is a fact. That's a fact, though. A nigga was older now. A nigga was broke, so like until I was like 12, 
Episode 13, I ain't handle, we ain't handle shot with the crib. We only had, you know what I'm oh, saying? Oh, yeah, that age. That's yeah, so yeah, I took that. So I take baths. Yeah, we took baths. And, then, and sure. then they, they, they made. Think my mom and them let us take showers. Yeah. They, they, made, the, the, they made the little connected piece that you could put on the, the bottom of the toes, a rubber thing. You put on the bottom of the uh, spout. I was rich. I wasn't rich. Nigga, I stole that from the beauty supply. <laughs> <laughs> like I wanted to take a shower I was going to my friends I was taking showers We ain't had no shower In our crib So I stole it from Beast But I put it in my pants Got up out of that bitch But it was a little spot That you put on the on the, on the thing That went the water Boom And then you It's a you suction cup And then you Boom That was um, a horrible Horrible selection In time to steal Yeah I mean for the record. I, I wanted to take a shower <laughs> That's what you were Going to go to jail over Something I want I want put in your gotta, shower You got to catch me And then the, the crazy This nigga is responsible crazy. What's your crazy The crazy <laughs> thing is the <laughs> That's the responsible shit At 13 you, you know the crazy thing is <clears throat> I used to have to Take that bitch down Because My mama and them be like Where the fuck you get this from So I used to take it down Keep it in the room And like in the back of my drawer And shit and everything Like it was a fucking toy I got or something. a house with privacy That's amazing I was the only kid man If I was gonna get a whooping My mama walk in While I'm in the tub And throw the switches Bro. In the water oh, no, I, got, I, got, I got those yeah. They set yeah. me not you to break them, them. I broke them that. bitches got, Every time You wanna go back outside I remember I remember like, One time I was at school Nigga I got in trouble I'll never forget this shit I was at school Nigga my daddy my, This nigga called me Bro said, when I see you, I'm gonna fuck you up, bro. I was like, damn. I was like, damn. Nigga. I'm he don't he don't come to the crib. Like he didn't stay with this type shit. Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking like, all right, I'm looking at the clock. It's eight o'clock, nine o'clock. He ain't came yet. I'm good. Bro, I'm in a bathtub, folks, just laying in the water, just chilling. <laughs> Nigga come out of nowhere. <laughs> switch, whipping my shit. I woke up, bro. See, I, I was too see. animated. I got I got my ass woke. I was too I thought too much. Me too. Cause when you see me, I'ma cover myself. Now you don't see shit. No, fact you said me. when you see me, <laughs> you was gonna fuck me up. <laughs> Nigga, the way I would dodge my daddy's vision. Oh my goodness. Bro ass fuck me up in that motherfucker. <laughs> I would dodge his vision. That nigga had me fucked get up. Get out your way. I was yeah. in there so nigga, sick about that shit. I was so bad until so I used to get whoopings. I used to get a whooping me at lecture. I used to just bust out cussing so I could get my ass whooped right then because the lecture was a torture. Somebody trying to hear that Man, shit. sitting there making me listen to a lecture, it, dry, it makes Whoop me angry ass. and it makes me talk back. Like I had a real bad problem say with talking back. back. So then when I learned that's what pissed him off and he can get me a whoop and they can get the fuck out of my face, I'm going to talk back till you get so angry you damn have to punch me. But I'm going to bed and get back on my damn game because now you punch me and you feel bad. No so a whooping, they won't feel no bad. Bullshit, but if they punch you, that's when your parents come in the room like, I'm about to go get some need. It depends you want to go on how much something? they do it. Or the parent, like, see, I, I ain't have my daddy, so it was, I ain't never been punched by him. But my mama punched me. And that, that shit wouldn't that shit the same that shit is the equal value as a whooping. Well, so, no, nah, hell no. Nah. He my, my daddy whooped that shit. Equal value. Time, nigga. She don't give she a fuck. Came in Milwaukee, nigga. I had got in trouble at school. This nigga picked us up. Bro turned all the lights off. Just whooping my ass in this motherfucker. Ew, what you whooping you <laughs> in the dark? Bro, in the dark, beat the fuck out of me. And it was other kids in there? Me and Flat, nigga, me and my little brother. Whooping our ass. So he didn't give a fuck who he is. <laughs> he was nigga, in that bitch. The, light, the lights came on, bro. Looked at us. <laughs> nigga said, I want to get some ice cream, bro. <laughs> this nigga that done hell in the cell. He, he had to turn the lights off because he didn't want to see y'all. He that was nigga, like, that, that nigga hit himself. Turn the lights off. That nigga hitting himself hey, damn, getting mad. Yeah, imagine somebody. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's how he's swinging that bitch, though. He holding my damn hand up. Nigga. <laughs> my ass. My mama whooping me one time, hit herself in the face and beat me like I hit her in the face. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, stop. Go check on yourself. Yeah, you, you fucked so you, up. She basically feel like she, you did. Oh, what yeah. though? You the reason I hit you myself in the I face. Hit myself. Yeah, I, I wasn't even been here swinging. Stop, <laughs> stop saying I'm whooping you because I love you. Bitch, oh, you man. mad. You are not. You mad? Because you love you, yeah, bro. I think it's that both. is a lie. It's no, both. It's no, it's not. Both. What a love that in this. The love part about it. I'm, I, it's a I, lesson. I, I, that ain't it. no fucking lesson yeah. in life required. I, some, I, something ass. gonna happen to you, man, you when you don't do what you gonna sneak. Do. That's only thing gonna change is you gonna sneak and do I it. I get them. I get them. I bust ass and ass, bro. And I don't do it because I yeah I love them and I'm always gonna love them. But at that point in time. I'm you angry. piss me off, nigga. Yeah. And I I'm let you whooping that ass me. because you piss me off and you know better. So you yeah, they call CPS for yeah, shit. Yeah, they call CPS. Times change. It, it, it ain't <laughs> that shit. Now no what more. I tell him? What I tell him? I I got a pair of boxing gloves that he keep. 
I got a pair. The, he got he got his. You you you. This nigga taller. He's six three. Damn, you got a man child. So we go into the bathroom, man, man. and if you can, if you you, you can brother, you can punch me wherever you want to punch me at. You, brother, you can punch me wherever you want to punch me at, and I'm not gonna punch you in your pretty face. But I guarantee you, you're not gonna walk out this bathroom before me, and I don't get no fuck if they hear it. I'm still doing it because we in the confines. So what you gonna do if something happened? He actually do beat your ass, you, and then so I'm you submit now. And no, I'm well, be you like, you ain't gonna get your, your ass whooped and challenge him again. You just not gonna. No, do no, that. no. no if he, we gonna jump that man. No. <laughs> every time. Yeah, I'm not. Every time. I'm not every time. Like, like, what is he like, slipping ball and he I'm catch you with that. a good ass cross? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not doing it. Man, you better leave these kids alone. Man. You better stop fighting. Listen, these kids. I, you go to sleep. These kids are crazy. Listen, listen I go, they, go, they go to sleep too. These kids got everything. They go, they, ADHD, they go depression. to sleep too. I jump in my eyes. I, I, I jump at Ashton ass and he'll jump out his drawers so scared. I remember I caught my daughter watching Slender Man one time. I sat her down and put my pistol down. Now, let me explain to you why. Now, I go to sleep. You have now lost the rights to come in my room for anything between the hours of 1 a.m. And 7 a.m. Because why the fuck are you watching? Y'all know Slender Man? It was a nigga who... The kids overseas saying Slender Man was telling them to go kill their parents. Oh, hell They man. had a whole movie on this shit. Hell, man. Oh, overseas, they throw the fuck out. Man. They got a whole I forest to kill yourself, I nothing called man. Slender Man. They got a forest where, with a bunch of big-ass trees to kill yourself in. For real? Remember, Jake Paul got in trouble for putting it on there because it was an actual body... In the damn tree while he was filming him going over there. One of them power brothers. But it's a oh, forest overseas where you go to kill yourself. They were I, I heard it. Ain't it like and one of them Asian crazy. countries? Yeah, it's like something like yeah, that. Yeah, I, I think one of, crazy, I heard man. Shit. It's one of them Asian countries. Mother crazy. They can't <clears throat> clean up, fuss, fight, fuck. They can't do nothing. Yeah, these new niggas. They can't do anything. But get I think I've phone. seen that. Like, I've seen people that like traveled all the way like from the United States all the way there just yeah, to kill themselves. Just to go kill themselves. Like, they so could have gave that money to. So it's a ones. landmark type shit, like they where people gave, do that for real. It's a wonder of the world. It's crazy. That is that is. <laughs> I that killed is myself. Wild. It's a couple people coming with me. That's gonna be the only time. Oh, that, that would be the only time I have to kill myself. It'd be crazy. It's it crazy. Be some shit like, going on. There's a cliff. If I don't kill myself inside of a food place, somebody killed me. I was assassinated. They didn't kill me because that's the last thing I'm gonna do. For? If I die anywhere outside of Popeyes, somebody kill. Like Don't brisk. let them tell you. Brisk is fire. Brisk. Yeah, brisk. Oh. Hey, I'm still, I'm still kind of curious on this. Quiz, you want one of these? Uh, uh, to, to segue back, what's the last two? What's the last two burger spots? Oh, I thought he only had one more. Uh, I only had one more, don't I? No, yeah, you yeah, are. You are. Right. He said McDonald's. 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 He Stop. But y'all he know, got, nigga. What does that mean? What is uh, what is that? What does that mean? They said it would it be. I that shit. That shit. What she did for Kamala was. I don't think that was. That was wild to me. I think bro. that was the worst choice this nigga Kamala could have made. But Just because we do ignorant things and we're black, don't make us. The right don't make us uh, embarrassing in a way. No, it's I mean, just like, us because the shit they do at Donald Trump rallies is wild. No, that's, no I'm that, saying that nigga do some wild. You're not about shit. to win me that over, nigga came by out but they, they, they try to nigga, out they to try to coon man. us. They try to coon you. Who you talking about? That, Kamala. That. Like I hate that. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. It's like, bitch, we ain't seen. That's what I mean by that. Like, nigga, you don't got grambling, grambling in Prairie View had a game. Southern and goddamn grambling had a game. All the AKAs was there. They just had a whole AKA festival in downtown Dallas. Yeah. Yeah. Another nigga ain't nothing down there but slips and girdles. Every AKA was there. He slips and girdles. Where was Kamala? Type shit. 
where has she been all this time? And then people try to relate their trauma to it, like, oh, black women got it harder. This ain't a black woman thing. For one, the bitch ain't black. She's Indian. Her dad is some from somewhere, bro, but he lived in up, Jamaica. Bro. She likes niggas. He up. lived in Jamaica, but her dad, I believe they both they're Indian and Asian or some shit. And she, but with because they look down. black, we be so ready to jump on shit. Like we we done it already. We've experienced the black impulsiveness. Right. Now we gotta actually think who is gonna make it better for us. Not for us, for our kids when we leave. So people so scared of Prop Twenty Five, like I hate that coward shit, that pussy shit. Like, oh, they gonna do this? And they ain't gonna do shit. We are they source they make- of all their privilege. We are the source of it. They need us to spend money. Fact. But they pull slave tactics. They 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 they'll kill Scary. one nigga yeah. to make everybody else fear. You ever know this nigga? You'll see two cops harassing niggas in a crowd of thirty people, forty people, fifty people. And nobody, nobody with six nothing. shots apiece. It was a time they only had six shooters. Now, niggas could have been and niggas could fifty niggas could take over Easily. a whole town of white people. Easy, we cut their hair. But you get comfortable because you seen that nigga hanging from that tree and that fear. Every grown adult. I don't know what camera I'm on. Go watch Inside Out. If you don't understand your emotions, go fucking the watch cart- that cartoon. Yeah, movie. I wanted to. That shit ain't for kids. I, I wanted, no, no, that shit is shit for though. adults. I wanted to. No, no, I'm just saying. That shit is for adults. Because the kid ain't gonna understand it. I wanted to strangle it. sadness. Like, yeah, like. I wanted to, I wanted to strangle her. No bullshit, yeah. bro. I no wanted bullshit, to strangle bro. her, bro. I was like. Oh, you saw it? Yeah, I just seen that shit this summer. I seen both of them. I seen Inside Out and Inside Out too. I, and the first one, I wanted to strangle that little yeah. girl. And I was rooting for it because she blew. Oh, the two was what? Two. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas got a brain. Two, game. two was what? Oh, the real oh, blue got to be blue. Yeah, but two I was what she got to be I was right? mad. Yeah, she <laughs> I didn't feel like no I wanted to strangle her. And but anxiety, I, I wanted to kill that nigga. I'm mad, though. I want, y'all seen the most Y'all seen two? I seen one. Y'all seen all Before you go to two, the most powerful scene in one. Is when the girl, well, her emotions was getting out of order. The mom, they showed the mom emotions and the dad emotions. Oh, they the showed dad everybody just showing oh, his happy place. Mm-hmm. The mom is showing I'm concerned, but she didn't communicate concern to the dad. So now he looking like what up? I haven't I been addressed. What's I'm up? tuning everything out. I'm doing what I enjoy. I'm watching the game. Type shit. But all she had to simply do was communicate. But she wanted him to understand. Cause she based off yeah. I'm listening I care Why do he care Why don't he care Why don't he feel like that So now you worried About the little girl And you angry At the same time With the dad Nigga that shit Was a powerful scene bro That'd be real That shit, shit is a powerful scene That'd be real shit Hell bro. yeah Trauma a motherfucker That bitch is a beast Cause it, it can That's a it, Pixar movie right? It can exist yeah. for so long But it also sparked <clears throat> What I call like Temporary emotion Like rage Rage ain't something your heart and your body can physically take 24 hours. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's impulsive. It comes in moments. I get mad. Uh, All yeah. that shit stems from trauma. You wake up in the morning. You feel like, I just, I'm tired of trying. I want to give up. I'm sad. All that shit stems from trauma. Memory, you don't even know when it when it started. That motherfucker trauma is damn near the brain. of The, the brain of poor mental health. That bitch is the brain of it. Because it pumps so many temporary emotions. And that's the greatest plan not to go biblical, but my grandfather used to tell me the greatest plan to ever come out of hell was to make people, not make people think they don't have to get saved. Just make them think they got all the time in the world to do it. And if you pay attention to how the world is, nigga, that's what they do. They distract us with time. We, like, we, we'll even go through sleep deprivation just to spend time to absorb more ignorance. We'll sit in our beds and scroll, or we'll watch something with violence on TV. You'll go to bed. That's why they say you shouldn't have a TV in your room. The news. You should not have a TV in your room because when you get to your room, that's your place of peace where you you let your mind rest. Turn that TV. You ain't supposed to have a TV because the shit you feed yourself when you go to sleep, nigga, that shit, even though you can't hear it, that part, that 15% of you that's alive, nigga, feel that energy. You don't ever go to sleep watching the news. Conscious. I used to go to sleep to porn because I wanted to be a better fucker. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> I was like, something in my conscience is going to pick up on this. <laughs> and believe it or not, that, like, some men at work because it helped me know how to talk to women. Let me be retroactive at this. Let me put some mm. porn on while I sleep so Hell it should yeah. get in my conscience. They yeah, say Mozart make a baby smarter. So I was like, that makes sense. Porn got to make me fuck better. 
That's how uh, that's how my pops was learning how to speak Spanish. This nigga used to go to sleep with headphones on. That spoke Spanish. That nigga's a serial killer. He stays um, still all night and don't move. That's what I was saying. Nigga, that nigga. He's in the military. This nigga be that dead, explains man. it. You can't move in the military. Type shit. But yeah, that nigga. He used to, he had to learn Spanish. That nigga stayed with some headphones on to sleep. Shit was playing all night. That is annoying as shit. Sounds like. I don't like but that's how niggas go to sleep to water sounds. I don't want them in my ear. That's how niggas go to sleep to to water sounds and all of that shit. Oh yeah, I do that. Rain. That black screen on YouTube. Yeah. Where the screen turned black, but it still got the sound. Yeah. That shit is magical, nigga. I fuck around and miss a job interview in that sleep. (laughs) Nigga, that sleep is different. (laughs) That sleep different. That rain sound shit. Yeah, it's just it is crazy how niggas sleep better in the rain. Hurricane Katrina. I still remember to this day the best night of sleep I have ever had in my entire life. Wait, where was you at? The, I was in Mississippi, but I slept through the whole night. <laughs> it was black as a bitch out there. It was black as a bitch. Man, that man. whole <laughs> week just was. So I didn't have, like, bro, we didn't have TV. We didn't have too much. Ra- we had the radio, but we didn't have, no, you know what I'm saying? We didn't have a lot. And nigga, I got some of the best food and best sleep. Nigga, I went on a fingering marathon bro. during goddamn on her like, Katrina. Nigga, it's black as a bitch. Bro. You can't even see We used it, to nigga. sleep on the trampoline every night because it's so hot. Yeah. Sleeping on the trampoline. Every girl in the neighborhood. Psh, nigga, it was a, nigga, it was a <laughs> night of magic. I don't know how nobody didn't get pregnant. I had a freak show going on in the side. Hey, bro, I told y'all niggas was getting down for uh, the uh, church shit. With the, them uh, church retreat? Yeah. Nigga. Oh, yeah, nigga. I got some of the best. Nigga, let me tell y'all a story right quick. <laughs> so, one time, we went to this other church. <laughs> we went to this other church. And we got it, my girlfriend at the time. She rode the bus with us and everything. So, nigga, I done fingered her for probably about the whole 40 time. miles. The whole time. Nigga, my forearm right here was y'all throbbing. Y'all know y'all some South niggas. Because South niggas nigga, always nigga, talking miles. I'm they don't ever talk in time. <laughs> they be like, yes. <laughs> it's, it's like one mile up the road. I'd be like, what? How, how long does it take those? Nigga, my forearm is pounding. So, nigga, listen, I get out. <laughs> I get so mad. My cousin Cordell, my bad game. He went, I, he like, yeah. TT shit just up the my. What, what is that? What is it? We don't even say up the road. How long is that? Bro? Where I'm from, we say up the road. Like, yeah, up the road. road. Oh, yeah. That's up the road. That's up the road. Bro, that nigga, call, down the I road. call that Cordell. That is shit. Mama restaurant about four miles up. Then you that make a left at the, the white, at the white store. What the city y'all say around right. the corner? But shit, that's so two minutes. you live on Forest Lane and you go in the garden. Oh, it's right around the corner. That's, Dude, a, that's not around the corner. That's around the corner, corner fool. If it takes 15 minutes, that's around the corner. my life. This is not a fucking corner. <laughs> that's this around the corner. If it's 20 minutes or less, that's around the corner, man. Hell no. Hell that's no. Around, no. The around the corner is around the corner. For real. So, <laughs> nigga, so listen, no, that shit, I guess that's just some Chicago shit. That's not it's weird. you literally going right here and making that no. one left or right. If I'm going that way, I'm going on the other block. Block. I'm going on. A, I'm going on other block real quick. I'm going oh yeah, Chicago. Yeah, I do be on them blocks. Right. Yeah, I'm going, like to going to other block. A whole other world. If I'm going, hell yeah, one sixty third, one sixty fourth, and one sixty fifth all hate each other. Yeah, <laughs> nigga, that is horrible. <laughs> <laughs> and what if it's one, two, three, and five? So what the fuck do four do? I don't like. I I love everybody. Four is in the middle. Listen, we got yeah, uh, it's just, in, in Milwaukee. We got a twenty fourth street and twenty fourth place. That's right by each other. I mean, I, in the hundreds, y'all got yeah, we, 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 we get y'all to, got that. Like, what do you? Know? No, <laughs> no, no, red like <laughs> my whole county. I'm about to tell you. I'm about to tell you. <laughs> one red light. That, like, <laughs> the, <laughs> God, we didn't even have blocks, one, nigga. The half a blocks don't go everywhere. So when you get to like, what is a half a block? Who measured this? I'm about to tell you. Like a like a whole a, 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 a whole block is boom, right? You cut that bitch in half. Now you got street and you got place. So I stayed on 52 West, 113th place. The block in front of me, in the house right behind me, was 52 West, 113th Street. You feel now me? I see why y'all niggas just say around the corner. I would say around the corner too if I had explained it that way. <laughs> like, like, it's how you were speaking Chinese to me. I was like... But see, we got in the... In the in the, on the south side and the mm-hmm. east side of Chicago, we got number street, numbers and names, mm-hmm. right? On the west side of Chicago, it's just like Ed Wilson, where I ever been. Well, not Ed Wilson, because Milwaukee got numbers in yeah. But like here, it got two name streets. You know what I'm yeah. saying? 
Yeah, in the country. Yeah, where I'm from, your town. Is named. Your place where you live is named after your church. I grew God. up in Damn. Rose Hill. Damn it's there. a church called Rose Hill. North Pleasant Hill. It's a church called North Pleasant Hill. Well, well, Mount Carmel. <laughs> it's a <laughs> church named Mount Carmel. Yeah, That's how it. slow I like. They don't even put no creativity in it. They ain't no places, drives. Yeah, everything yeah. is a street or a road where but I'm from. When it come like that though, like. That's because they don't have blocks though. Like they doing this. Our shit, our shit kind of just yeah. it, it's like a, a, a map that you just drew. Yeah. Oh yeah. Sections, <laughs> sections is after families. I'm a Moor, so where all my family live, that's Mo Hill. Shit, I want though. Yeah. That's Mo Hill. You got a lane. All the McDuffies live down there. That's McDuffie Lane. That's Everett Lane. Like that's literally our blocks and streets, and nigga, they are few and far between. Yeah, the country way different. Nigga, than the I city. had to walk a mile through the woods to get over to another street, <laughs> <laughs> and that's the quick route. You feel me? That's the quick. But real, I'm gonna tell you because you sitting right here, so I'm just like, I get in the car from getting out the church bus from fingering old girl. <laughs> My mama is driving. She asked me to do like the, this little thing on her window used to get jammed. Her window used to get jammed, so I reached across her. And but I went it. high. And she smelt it. <laughs> Nigga. She smelt it. I sat back in my seat. She said, sit back. And just went the backhand in my shit. I'm like, what I do? Why your hands smell like pussy? That's how I know she was mad. Because my mama don't even say them kind of words. She say dumb shit like JJ. <laughs> your pie. Oh, your birdiness. The birdiness. That shit is a vagina. <laughs> What the fuck is a birdie nest? <laughs> birdie nest. Oh, my dick no wings. I'm sure birdie call me that I'm, 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 I'm not fucking you. Talk so about your birdie nest. Yeah. You girl, listen, what? You got to grow up, baby. So we mama, got the bird. 34. She's still talking about <laughs> how your weenie. My mama, don't ask me if I got a dick now. <laughs> I'm coming in miles, kitty. <laughs> like, it's going down. This is not Winnie Bird activity no more. That's what when you still used to piss and it hit the floor and you just walk out like you didn't do it. You do that with a Winnie that Bird. Nigga said, how you a Winnie? <laughs> this nigga hell. Shit. But yeah, she knocked the hell out my ass real quick. Hey, but yeah, that's, I was trying to tell them niggas that's a real thing. Hell what? yeah, the south is so much different from that the city. Shit. Yeah, that church. Uh, like, see how many people y'all got on the highway at all times. That's how I know I'm so, I'm, I'm really from the country because that angers me. Like I'm so on the street people. right now. I'm on the street, Get the but I'm up. angry at everybody else. You know some shit that angers me that I can't control, but it's so stupid and big back of me. You ever been at the light and it's a car in front of you, and you on your way to get something to eat, Panda Express, whatever you want, Sunny. Somewhere yeah. with the lights, Chick Fil A. Yeah, and then we go through two lights. Chick Fil A coming up, they make a right. You need to turn into the Chick Fil A now. They make a right, and they get in right before me. Oh, bitch! I'm angry. I'm <laughs> I am heated. I, I ain't never even thought it. About I not past you a long time ago. Hey, I feel the same way. I, I ain't you. never thought about I this. Do. I be feeling the same way. I be. And I don't even know why. It only Damn, happened I could have passed your happened. ass and got in front of you. <laughs> That's exactly I got to wait thinking, one more bro. person in front of me now. <laughs> I, I grew up got in front of your ass. Right? Oh, yeah. Every time I'm at a light, if I'm at a light and there's three cars beside me, Fast and the Furious play in my head. Oh, for sure. I'm for the rest of me. my life, it don't ever change. I got to beat you. And if I lose, I talk so bad to myself. Bitch <laughs> <Get your> ass, <laughs> nigga. Whole ass. Fat fuck. Trash. Why would you let that fucking Toyota Sienna beat you like that? Bitch ass, nigga. Hey, I definitely have a race. If, yeah, yeah. I got to Did I tell I'll be driving the van like NASCARs though. You texted it. You I told you, yeah, yeah, bro. I swear to God, nigga, I was trying to wipe my ass with that shit. Wait, what? Wait, what? What the uh, fuck just happened? Wait, that's why I said, wait. We back on behinds. You don't have an ass. <laughs> no, nah, he's he got a behind. He's behind. talking about his behind. He don't he, have an ass. He was on a podcast. I think it was last week. He said, uh, "I don't like going to people's house." With, got one, uh, one one totally strand of tissue. I got some one ply tissue that I um, bought by accident, nigga. I wiped my ass with bro. a bundle of it, <laughs> bro, just to try to get I rid of it because the nigga, nigga won't let me throw it away. I swear, and to I God. ain't buying no more. Until I was I'm at out. work, nigga. That shit was so <laughs> rough, nigga. I had to. You gotta wet that shit. If you gotta spit on it, if you desperate enough, Yo, pause. Damn, but you gotta bro. do what you gotta do. <laughs> 
No bullshit. You a grown man. You at bro. the age now. You need to go to Walmart for ninety seven cent. They got these little wipes, these flushable wipes. Oh, yeah, I don't know sure, where you at. Sure, if you sure. wipe your ass with tissue, it's not clean. I'm just it's saying it's a temporary treatment. I'm at work until you get to the back to the toe. Yeah, I'm at work. Yeah, so wet know wipes. that wet wipes. Wet wipes. That's why niggas be getting caught with the tissue with the doo doo draws because wet they get, get too comfortable. No, nah, I told these niggas they story get too before. comfortable. Nigga, my granny always told me wipe till it's white. So one day I'm playing, 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 and the kid wipe real quick. Go back outside. Playing, I'm like, hey, oh, no, he ain't had no issue. That nigga had them booty clickets. <laughs> I was like, what the that fuck? I had them booty Going in the house, I'm like, man, let me just check white shit. Still stupid, bro. I'm like, damn. <laughs> I'm mad at myself. <laughs> like, bro, I would never let this happen again. Oh, what the? <laughs> I don't never want my booty itch paws ever again. From that day, I used to use wet wipes and, and, yeah. and let a and let a bit let a motherfucker call it sassy. Listen, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I say so you think I'm cleaning my ass. Yeah, yeah bro. I'm, I'm, I'm a fat nigga. I'm I gotta clean, clean my ass properly. You see, you probably get your wipe. I gotta tilt the tip of that finger up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure I get everything. That nigga it's, said. A, it's, a, it's a little crease in there. I gotta make sure I get it. Like, hey, I'm telling you, bro, it's a lot of niggas walk around your homeboy got. These niggas got hey, immature hey, butts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga say immature <laughs> got immature butts. No, they bullshit. will not grow up and clean their body. But properly. you know what? Look, the the craziest thing is to me when you realize, like, just to on the smaller scale, like, like you you know you might put hand sanitizer on when you come from outside mm-hmm. after touching everything. Then you start to see your homies and they don't do it. I get to thinking like, bro, these especially niggas, after COVID. Like these niggas probably nasty as Especially a bitch. Especially after COVID. Yeah, that that shit, man. Real quick, Bro. it's you know who niggas opening. really taking a bath. What's your best soap to cologne ratio? Like, what's y'all best? Like, for example, for me, if it's summertime, I gotta go on um, the Pink Dove bar with the Valentino cologne. I always use the. I only use the that Pink Dove bar with that Valentino cologne. Is a. I don't need nothing else for the summer. I don't need to try nothing else. That bitch is magical. I'm always using Dove, bro, with anything. Some niggas though, they just skip the bathroom. They smoke the soap and go straight to the cologne. Straight to the cologne. Like, no, hey, nigga. nigga. I'm a weird nigga. I know some blend. niggas that done did that before. It's a blend. Even when Yo, I even when I'm taking a quick shower. Shit. Even when I'm taking a quick shower, bro, if I know I gotta hop in there real quick, bro, I'm finna hop in there and goddamn. <laughs> You know, A-Rail say, like, fuck the other bro, fuck on the my life, bro. and go straight to the cologne. On like, my how life. How did you get to the chemical first, Habib? I be thinking like, fuss, it ain't no way you don't <laughs> smell that <laughs> shit, bro. <laughs> Diet, bro. It's but you know what? I've learned what stank <laughs> to us <laughs> don't stank to them. They, it's just they, they diet, like, bro. Yeah, it's, not, it's their natural thing. Like, bro, yeah, I don't should. know if you ever had Ethiopian food. This yeah, girl yeah, gave yeah, me right. Ethiopian food, and she gave me these things that look like dish rags. It looked like wet fucking dish rags. And then they're gray. Nothing in the food department is appealing in gray. Nothing. Why the fuck is this? When I open it up, then you open it up, and it's like a sponge on the bottom. And all I like to think in my head is, dang, Lord, it's people out here poor enough that they look at this like, this is food. Because I tasted that shit. Nigga, I will die of starvation if that was the only thing left in the- I eat meat before I eat that. Off your leg. Hey, if your friend died, your homie died, and y'all, it was just y'all two, would you eat that nigga to survive, Pauls? Well, I eat my homie. Depending on what homie it is, cause I got a homie that don't take baths a lot. <laughs> Man, I, don't, I can't eat food that's over salty. My body won't let me. Cause I ate too much already. My bank is full. <laughs> but, you, <laughs> you gonna, but you eating the coochie that's over salty? Oh, hell no. I ain't eating no coochie that tastes like nothing. Oh, okay. No, I'm I ain't, let me not lie. I have. I have a Gucci that tastes like something. So if it smell like yeah. something, but it don't taste like nothing, you Gucci. I done had something that tasted and smell, but it's like I'm already here. Like, <laughs> you committed. I'm, I'm committed. I'm dedicated. How long do the taste last? The but whole just, time? It was crazy because pussy is tricky because you can get some pussy that smells perfectly fine, don't have no smell, but 13 strokes in, it's like you hit this smell pocket and it just goes off a whole different odor. <laughs> Like it's crazy. No, it's, like that's it's, the it's a lot crazy. of people. I'm just saying. She yeah. Said it's hot. I mean, I'm just saying. Some. I'm just saying. Some funk is buried. It's suppressed. It ain't on the surface. They don't put all that lotion on. 
<laughs> but that's that wax pussy though that do that. That wax pussy do that. That coochie with her only got a barrier of protection on it. <laughs> <laughs> that's the truth. That's, that's why coochie shit, hair is there. You supposed to clean it. And people say dumb shit like, well, hair catch bacteria. Yeah, bitch, and soap is antibacterial. You clean it. Yeah, for sure. Why the fuck are you skipping that process? Yeah, for sure. I don't want no purse pussy with no hair on it. Whole bacteria. Bitch, shut up. Nah, Cause you sound stupid And you too grown to sound that stupid Niggas don't understand And they don't even understand Nigga coochie hair I ain't saying overly coochie Cause you ever fuck no, no bush. You ever been stroking That ain't wet already I And some of that bush. coochie hair Get in between Your dick and her walls And you don't even realize Why it's happening You are cutting the shit Out of your dick right now yeah. Yeah, I've been Boy, there. that after shower, after Listen, fucking somebody who got one, of, got I, this. I was a, on that culture. I was a fresh. I was a fresh twenty one working at this uh, old head bar. <clears throat> you had to be thirty five and older to get in in Chicago mm-hmm. called Sweet Georgia Browns. Right. Got me a school out of that hole. She about forty eight, forty nine around now. I'm talking about. She was one of them bone chicka wong wongs. If you want to call it, that's what she was. She was, you know yeah. what I'm it was what it was. Now you know the time we came up in. Right? Yeah, and she, you know what I'm saying, but I'm talking about, I'm talking about. <laughs> that's not an excuse, right? On what? Tri- <laughs> big, just saying. big, no, no. big triangle <laughs> bush, saying. but it was A like triangle bush, like it, like 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 the size was shaved perfectly. Like when you have an underwear, on, you can't tell. On you can't oh, so you she tell. Had, oh, she had that blade. <laughs> she had the, the outline. She had that blade. <laughs> the blade, but it was it was. <laughs> no, they call that an eddy. That's an eddy. <laughs> oh yeah. That, yeah, that it, bitch was puffy. I was like, was damn. Like, she was Afro, she, you know? like that bitch was big. She had a, high like, top she had a big ass hairy pussy. I was like, damn. I ain't never hit nothing like this. But what you say? I'm already I'm here. Already here. I was like, what was the texture of the bush? That's important because it was it went it went it went nappy. Bro, nappy pussy hair is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> 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 nappy. It's wild. It is some nappy coochie hair out here, D. Listen, though. I'm it not is some nappy. <laughs> the texture matters. The, so straight, you can have a fro- the a straight shit is crazy, too, though. Yeah, but it depends on what kind of straight. Like, if it's, no, 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 hold on. Because if you be getting outside the black race straight, that's what I mean. it's not the same. You yeah. should be there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should be there. That's it. That's it. That's Yo. Bitch got a ginger got bush. A little, no, no, no. She got a little ponytail down there. She ain't not supposed to have color. <laughs> that nigga said she got a ponytail. Like, you know how they put it in a ponytail and then it hangs? It's just the little piece. <laughs> no, and it hangs though. Like, that's how it looks. That like, shit, got that shit that be all, it be right here, right but it's laid back. down in their thigh. Oh, yeah. You been hitting them damn sand. You been hitting them, hey, you been over there now. <laughs> That's what got that coochie hair like that. That coochie hair is crazy. <laughs> that shit was crazy. Like, I'm like, not when I seen that, I was like, <laughs> them, hey, them motherfuckers, like, hey, bro. that coochie hair is so long, you can count them. <laughs> like, you can see the follicle. You think she got 750 pieces? Hell no. Bitch, this is a 600 thread count. Oh, my God. Bitch, this got the same thread count as my twin size. Bitch, see, the fact that she got her shit in the ponytail is wild. Wild, bro. No, that's what it looked hey. like though when I saw it. Cause it wasn't the whole thing. <laughs> you doing thing, cosmetology shit thing, with your coochie hair, bitch? Go shave that shit. <laughs> no bullshit. But when it got that perfect little bro and that like our beard, like that texture, like whoa, that's some good. That's some good. When she got a little hair right here, just on a little lip. outline in the mustache. My daddy used to tell me that's rich. She got rich blood. I never knew I had poor blood, but. This got rich blood. <laughs> they said when a woman got rich a little, with what? Uh, when women got a little bit of, um, you know what I'm saying, up under here, that's a hormone imbalance. But right in this area, they said he said that's rich blood. How you know a girl got rich some good coochie? I, oh. I don't know. I didn't have no question. <laughs> I didn't know what rich was. Good when they got a little hair on their arm um, right here, like they only grow hair right here. Good coochie. That bitch just on the top part of their arm, not the bottom. I should be that your bitch ass. will beat your ass. Oh, but she got good coochie hair, too. Yeah, I heard. I see. Yeah. I heard. I heard hairy arms, little little, little line, mustache, good coochie. Yep. I heard. But no switch. She a little mean. My auntie told. Like my auntie, my granny told me this. This is. I heard. Hell yeah. I ain't never heard that lip. You ain't never heard that lip shit. Yeah, heard that lip shit. yeah boy, you better learn how yeah. to identify good pussy. It's a dangerous world out here. You know what I mean? The niggas being conned out here for that money and all that time. You know, took that bitch a Perry Steakhouse. She like she got the full presentation of a bad bitch pussy. Sorry, yeah, that's sorry. That's just sick. 
Bitch is gonna send you a video. Shit, how you looking at yourself? Like, maybe it's me. <laughs> maybe it's me. Because I seen it on the video. It was wet as hell. But now you get in it, it's like. That bitch ain't That's Gucci. a hard feeling, boy. That bitch ain't Gucci. And that's some shit men don't even mention to women because we don't want to kill their Cause that Because you feel me? I'm trying to show you some love. Yeah, we showing you love. That's one of our little daggers we can throw. But once it, you throw it, that bridge is burning. It's over with. It's over with. You, if you still trying to hit, you you might as well just take that. that out. You know what's crazy about that? Because you, you, we won't say nothing, but uh, 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 I ain't, ain't going to call you Even if they talk shit. That's what I'm shit. saying. When they be talking shit, like, oh, yo, little shrimp dude. If she called that next week, you fucking. Man, bitch, this 3.5 got some power. I don't give a fuck what that bitch say. If I fucked you twice, <laughs> bitch, hey, you, you, you know my up? dick hey, has done what my up. dick is supposed to you do. You know what's up, nigga. Hell yeah, and I got features. <laughs> <laughs> so I can pull this stomach back like a convertible top, bitch. Uh, what, what, see, low? Pop the top and let the sun shine <laughs> in. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hell, Hell no. It's some bitches out there that's delusional. It's some delusional bitches oh, that you don't have a 10 inch dick pussy. You don't have that kind of pussy. That nigga hate fucking you. All you do is run around. That nigga is tired. I gotta get you in every, every corner. I gotta, yeah. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta lead you we to the wrestling, corner, bro. Men yeah. be wishing oh, for problems they don't even know. Yeah. Like, men be out here, like, he's real. Me be real. God damn. <laughs> they let women I'm tired convince of chasing them. Away. They let women convince them about the love they sell so much. They're like, damn, I want a big dick. Nobody told them about huge dick problems. Bro. Like, coming too fast. Bro. Having enough blood and proper function to get this motherfucker hard. For you to last on top I'm of more than two space, minutes. I am perfectly comfortable with that. I'm, and then I got the, I got the pullback feature. It's amazing. It's amazing. <laughs> the pullback is wild. Man, I'm talking That's about they say more, more deeper. You, you want more and deeper? I got a whole <laughs> cheek on. Pick the whole stomach up. Now I done got better. Not to throw my equilibrium up. I pick it up with my forearm. I do a little lean to the left. It gives more leverage on the stroke from the right. Now I done hit the perfect spot. Listen, I done hit the perfect spot. She don't know what's happening. She's coming. She's coming. She don't even know how. And it was all from confidence in yourself. Because I used to pick it up with the palm of my hand, but then my shoulder get tired. Then I feel this strain right up under my knot. It made me feel like something is wrong. Now I can't focus and my dick done went soft. That's, ladies, that's how easy it is for a man dick to go soft. That nigga can think oh, about yeah. the wrong it don't thing take too, much, too long and full on distract himself. You got to approach that pussy with confidence. Oh, that's the you got to get that pussy a pep talk. Bitch, I am the coldest digger on this fucking earth. Bro, I am so motherfucking cold that even when I am gone, is that why, will be is that why niggas be asking questions? This my pussy. I don't know. I don't ask no questions. Pussy. I don't talk because talking ain't make two take. That's, that's, that's distracting. Time. That's breathing. No, that, that, that ain't distracting. I don't talk. I don't talk. My nigga say it's air I mean, I'm here to fuck. I'm not here for a conversation. Because if you can open your mouth and respond to me, I'm not at the spot yet. Yeah, we ain't doing I'm not at the spot yet. If you talking, I'm not at the spot yet. It's little cheat code women don't even know niggas be out here doing. Like, I used to take a, when I'm getting head, I used to whisper to a bitch. When she say, huh, her throat will finally open up enough to let me go on and get on my bitch now. Because she when might she be holding it back. Huh? She uh, might not know how to suck dick. It's scary to open her throat up. Because believe it or not, bitches will panic well, too. I had that before. Bitches will panic too. You get in her throat and she didn't even know. Like, she got, how do I breathe? Bitch, through your ears. Everybody know that. <laughs> Everybody know that. Breathe through your ears. They all connected. It's right there. But if you, but listen, if you take her, if you distract her and just whistle, and she say, huh? And she say, huh, that next huh, go on in that motherfucker. It's open, I promise you. This is a fail-proof plan. <laughs> next time you get some hair, whisper. And when she say, huh, her throat gonna open up. But you did gotta be at least halfway in the mouth by now. If you can't go past the back of her tongue, nigga, wishful thinking. <laughs> but if you can go past the back, just right on the edge of her tongue, and she say, huh, <laughs> Everybody say huh right now, Paul. We don't pause first. I'm Everybody not gonna hold you. I'm, I'm, not, gonna, I'm not gonna hold you, Paul. No, that's I, like, huh. When you that's said like, it, huh. I did it. I did yeah. my breath. I was like, Ew. it's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> that's how I knew. That's how I knew. Like, hey, that's how I knew. Homie 
Jesus said, "Cause I would be had to be in the plan of God, cause my I did it too. I said, oh. and I felt it. I'm like, damn, that bitch opened up. Damn, the gay niggas got it too. It's equal opportunity. <laughs> like that's crazy, but." Oh my yeah, God. Yeah, make the same huh? <laughs> oh it's crazy. My God. You want to do it with the people? Make, make it stay on. Uh. Make it stay on. Make it stay on. It's a hump on the pussy. Listen. Listen. It's a, hey, it's a hump on the pussy, too. Oh my Take God. Take a safety pin. Take a safety oh, pin. Do shit. not stab this woman. Do not stab this woman. I'm saying that for the record. Don't stab this woman. Take a safety pin and put it between this oh, finger wow. and this finger just like this. Slide out just enough to feel the prick. While you fucking her, she ain't gonna notice that little prick just hit her right in the thigh meat. Just keep hitting her. That pussy gonna tighten up every time. Now, if you put too much out, bitch, that's assault. And you might go to jail. So you got to put a little bit of a safety you, pin You can't just use your fingernail? Nah, you got to pinch her. That's too much. Pinching oh, okay. and pulling, she gonna feel that. But if you take this... Look just a, just enough to poke out. You can use a needle. Just a little, Not stab little prick. it. Just, just prick, prick it. Just prick at it. Just prick it. Don't drag your finger, nigga. Still nah, don't cut nah, was this an old school uncle? Your daddy? Like, my daddy told, old me nigga told you this. My daddy one. told me this one. Old nigga told me this. Yeah, yeah. Old nigga told me this. Nah, my daddy ain't told me nothing about no pussy. Nigga, crack is gave me some of the best advice. He said, nigga, it's a hill down there. A lot of niggas gonna run down to that pussy. I'm gonna just walk. Somebody tired. <laughs> they gonna be tired. They're running. Hell no. Nah, just walk. He went crazy. You learned like nah, that. That's crazy. crazy. Oh no, this is real shit though. That's my what? auntie, nigga, hated my, my grandma used to battle. They, my grandma, man, go. My auntie used to have a '98 Oldsmobile '98. She used to come in her driveway and do donuts and throw a bird, throw the middle finger out the window and drive off. My grandma had this old gun. My auntie went and found it one time. This is the first time she shot it. Shot that motherfucker. Knock on her ass. Every time she shoot it, she fall on her ass. <laughs> one day she came. My grandma let her make it. She was like, you ain't going to do nothing but shoot that old ass gun and get knocked down on your ass. My auntie said the most profound shit to me there is a young nigga. No, I'm not. Today I'm going to lay down and shoot it. I said, this bitch done figured out the cheat code. <laughs> this bitch done figured out the cheat code. Yeah, I got something. And you can put that aspect on it. That's no, a fucking gym. <laughs> That's, That's a gym. I'm going to lay down and shoot it. Fuck it. If I'm going to fall down anyway, I'm going to shoot I'm from the ground. Just get down. Yeah, already. I'm going to shoot from the ground. Let's skip a step. Let's skip that step. I got a little more aim. I'm about to say my aim. A little aim time. Hell yeah. You got good stability. That is heavy <laughs> as fuck. You ain't got to worry about nothing. Nigga, you lay down and shoot that motherfucker. Yeah, that is funny as fuck. But since yeah. we, oh, since we was talking about food and burgers and shit. Let's get to this and shout out to shout out to the family. Shout out my nigga, man. Waffles, pancakes, or French toast. We gonna start our guests first. Nick, I'm gonna make a sandwich with all three. I'm gonna take that waffle, <laughs> cut it in half, put it in a in an egg shape. Cause X Men was my favorite show. show. I did not. X Men was my favorite show. Can I add stuff to it? Go. I'm no, gonna make no, a fried no. egg. Look at him. <laughs> make a fried egg. I'm gonna put that between the eggs on the waffle. That way, when the pressure come from the sandwich, it'll push each corn open slot of the egg down. <laughs> this nigga, you did this before. Then I'm gonna take some bacon. <laughs> no, nah, I'm just talking shit. Oh, uh, I, say, I mean, crazy. I was I wasn't privileged as a kid, so I never had French toast. It was either really it was only pancakes. You don't need to. You ain't privileged to have no French toast. No. No, you don't be privileged to have French toast where I'm from. I'm talking about nigga, you ain't never made was, French toast? Nigga, no. Nigga, in my house, we could bro, you know how, how fucking the bread was I was good. Good. I'm saying, how I, old are you? Listen, I'm 34. You know how mad I was when I found out that all cereal costs the fucking same? Are you using Like, this? pebbles and all this shit costs the same as cornflakes. Yeah. Why the fuck do we have six boxes of cornflakes on top of this refrigerator? That's what your mama like. And your grandma but probably. she ain't the one I had to eat that shit Now I got six pounds of sugar In one bowl of Ain't no bullshit plate. I was telling niggas I'm Nigga. scooping sugar out the Rice Krispies is the only cereal I eat plain. I was so oh, mad. Oh, hell no. I, I'm putting sugar in like, my Like, nigga, shit. having French toast is privileged. I'm from the country From a part of a town That's so slow That having shrimp Was a de- Nigga, at one point in time We only had meat on the Sunday When the preacher come When I say meat I mean real meats Like ham, turkey, ribs Throughout the week, we eating bullshit, chicken out of the can or something we done butchered ourselves. Make fish, fish y'all caught. Shit fish like we that. done caught. Shit like that. We like, 
Nigga, that's how I was. Like, I tell people all the time, they think it's weird, but uh, nigga, I never had a Lunchable till I was 17. Yeah, I ain't, it took me a minute to get a My Lunchable. My mama made me a Lunchable. She took some Oscar Mayer ham and cut that shit in, tri- in four triangles and then cut it again. I said, bitch, this is not a Lunchable. <laughs> you know, I heard I was. Gay I done West, told everybody, I'm going to have a Lunchable today. Gay West was saltines. Nigga, it was three Ziploc <laughs> bags <laughs> stapled <laughs> together <laughs> with some saltine crackers some sandwich cheese. She didn't even have the decency to take the fucking wrapper off. <laughs> the cheese. The, the plastic was still on that and bitch. And some chopped ham. This was my childhood. That's lit. How the fuck is hey, that? Hey, did y'all get the box of food dropped yes. off? Yes. Yeah. Nigga, my grandma, they offer my grandma five packs of cookies. Any five packs she want for $5. My grandma went and got five packs of Big Newtons. Oh, my mama. I oh, that's not that day. If it's up to me, she is going to a home. <laughs> <laughs> if it's up to me. Hey, but look, though. You <laughs> ate Big Newtons at the, at nah, the time. I can't do those. Did, you, did you eat prunes? Hell no. Nah. We, we had shit. We had a pear tree outside. So that's how I got my food. I mean, we I had, had, pear, I had we had, yeah, but shit, my grandma never had that's on the prunes. Hell no. Nah, oh, fuck. Prunes. Like, I, 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 I had that cast all with... in the belly button. That shit on took one time. I shit all over my grandma how she can do that no more. <laughs> Wait, the what? They put castor oil in your belly. Like, if you're a little constipated, they take castor oil. They put it in your belly button? Your belly I know back. castor oil, but I ain't never heard them. Put yeah, it you in lay your on your back and, and your belly button will drink that shit. It take a little time, but. I yes, never man. heard of that. That's how you clean yourself out. What I, I know castor oil, yeah. Hell my pops yeah. told me he used to do that. They used to eat it on the spoon, though. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, put that shit in your belly, but it's way more critical than that spoon. <laughs> Once that shit dissolves out of your belly, but nigga, it is on and cracking. DMX is playing. Party up. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I am not playing. Like, remember when Bookham found them diamonds on All About the Benjamins? That's what I heard. Yep, that's yeah. what I heard. That's <laughs> what what I crazy. Heard. He found them motherfucking diamonds. Nigga, hell yeah, nigga. I'm prune, but I don't do none of that shit. When you, you got a pear tree in your front yard, you don't need none of that yeah, shit. Yeah, we had, we had, uh, we used to eat the pecans off the off mm-hmm. the ground and shit. Uh, pears, apples, blueberries. It was something else. Now you ever ate a um, almost ripened banana? You don't need none I don't of these chemicals. No bananas like that. I ain't Get you a lie. banana ain't got no green. I mean, no y'all on that bitch is green. Eat that motherfucker. The best thing to clean you out, and you ain't got to deal with no chemicals or none of that shit. I'm talking about gonna get you right, right then. Eat at least eight little one a week. Cause you gotta, you can't just be fat and and, and, and you know what I'm saying not prepared. You gotta know how to survive. I gotta live. Type shit. So I need to be able to satisfy my big backyism. And keep my membership in the CPC. <laughs> that's the Clean Plate Committee, and and live. So you got to do things and live. Like that's the part people be forgetting. My six hundred pound life. They be forgetting the live part. Like they they on crystal milk level of a food addiction. Yeah, I'm just on coke. Like, I'm on coke. <laughs> What's weed? Weed is like them niggas who will be vegan. But they eat a whole bunch of snacks all day. Just shit that's horrible. <laughs> nigga ate a box of honey buns. Like, nigga, you are canceling out your veganism. You might as well just hate the meat. <laughs> pause, too. But I'm going to pause. <laughs> Man, we too grown for this pause. I, I got gotta say it, bro. I got to say it. I got to say it. Dalton, listen. If you had to pick, what's your... Is it in order? No, nah, I get it. You I mean, the one who got it. If it's your top three or what? Well, I we was going to disrespect you. Right? you, know I'm saying, I, you I got that, that suggestion. I drunk some Hennessy late at night and it's coming through me. You got to go to the No, I'm, I'm talking about sweating. sweating. Oh, shit. Probably, Everyone, you know, when you fat and you sweat, you got to stop talking. That's how you break the sweat. So I'm over here like, damn. <laughs> yeah, that's more than enough. Pass it on around. What you say, though? I probably fuck with the waffles. I grew up eating waffles. Number one? Yeah. Number What's one. number two then? We just gonna do number two and number two. Probably French toast, pancakes last. I can make you pancakes gonna make in my pancakes sleep. Last? Yeah. That's pancakes like making fries. That shit easy. That shit easy. I gotta. I, That's some privilege. It's so easy. I'm a, I'm a like go, to make. Or? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm pancakes go, aren't easy to make. Pause. Hold easy, on. No, the fuck is not. It's a technique. Are your ends crispy? Is that bitch still gold? Do that bitch have them little heat pockets on the that's bottom? Just, that's that part bubble cooking, out? <laughs> Nigga, <laughs> don't, like, don't just right, make the right pancakes. Right, ain't no bunch of bubble yeah, air pockets in there. For fresh toast, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, gotta at least have a fourth cup like, of butter in that pan before you, put, you make the pancakes. You gotta put like shit together bro, to make French toast. The like, first thing my much. daddy taught me how to make was pancakes, bro. This nigga went out of town for a week. Bro said, 
I'm going to show you how to make pancakes. That's all you need to survive. Like cornbread. Breakfast you cornbread. For breakfast <laughs> and warm up some chicken. Yeah. Nigga bought plenty packs of Tyson chicken and shit. Yeah, your daddy that. was responsible enough to whoop your ass, but he didn't give you no size, no vegetables, no eggs. That nigga gave me the chicken and pancakes. pancakes. I walk, nigga, I was every morning, nigga. Hell no. Nah. Pancakes. pancakes. Middle of the night, one o'clock in the morning, making pancakes. I ain't get French toast, so I was grown. That big girl blew my mind, nigga. She took some <laughs> melted strawberry ice cream and dipped the damn bread in the yeah, melted French, ice French cream. French toast, how you explore And bread. made French toast with it? i like, I think I love you. I, I you ever it. had French That's toast different. on brioche bread? Nigga, we can't afford that. I don't even know what that is. I, I thought you were talking about a bitch named brioche. <laughs> nigga, brioche. I, I, like, y'all know that brioche, bitch brioche bread is nasty as hell. The greatest French bread ever, bro. I swear to God, that shit. So, yeah, good. brioche is nice. Now that I'm grown, I didn't know about that as a kid. You got, no, that, yeah, you got brioche that, as a kid? No, I had that shit recently. My mom made French toast with regular sandwich bread. Right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cinnamon toast. Get this shit. This is sugar toast. I had this a million times. <laughs> that nigga said, I thought y'all was talking about when a you bitch said it was privileged. I'm like, shit, nigga, we took the same, the same bread I made a sandwich with, same bread I made my, French toast with. My mama, the same yeah. damn my bread. Mama, my mama used to make a uh, 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 gar uh, garlic bread out of hot dog buns. Oh yeah, you split the hot dog buns. But you know what's so you know what's crazy about that, bro? Niggas get money. And they used to do everything with hot dog buns, bro. I used to make peanut butter jellies with hot dog buns. Nigga. Oh my kids, bro. Anything I can make is something. I wasn't poor enough. Still bread. Maybe poor is a perception now. But I used to make peanut butter. I never had a lunch before we had bread. Listen, I smack, I smack. Bread bread is bread to me. I smack. Hot dog bun. Hot dog I was smash. You ain't never put that on a hamburger bun? I would smash that bitch. I smash like it. You ain't, you ain't never so look, out of again, bread. Again, fat is different Bruh. than people who are, are, are edibly responsible. I'm smashing the I hot dog bun. I got a certain <laughs> level that I don't go I'm below. I'm smashing the hot dog bun. And Remember, I'm, I'm, and I'm, you, and I'm, and I'm making and I'm making it motherfucking spicy. I'm, I'm smashing the hot spicy. dog bun. I'm putting it in a toaster. Toast that bitch. Oh, yeah, for sure. And then I slap See, yeah, a lip. You can't be in my mama kitchen that long as a kid. She okay. tell you go make a sandwich, nigga. You got three minutes. And bro, that's three minutes. I kitchen. got 15 seconds in the toaster. I got one second in my hand smashing. I got three seconds peanut butter and jelly because I fuck around and mix them. On gang, I'm out of there two and a half. First, uh, I'm, I'm gone. Hot peanut butter and jelly, I guess you could say. Like, as you a month going? ago, like two yeah. months ago. Me too. I What's didn't play hot? with food. Wait, like, I didn't play like with on food. The, like on, the, uh, on the stove, I guess. Like, like a grilled like, cheese. Grilled cheese, but uh, right. peanut butter and jelly. Peanut butter and jelly. I had my first one like a month ago. Nah, it's so many. It's so many combinations you don't know about. Yeah, that shit good. Bro, with the cream, they put the cream cheese on it. Bro, that shit was so good. I mean, when you toast bread, put mayonnaise. Don't put butter. Or put butter in the pan, but don't put it on the bread. But take mayonnaise, toast that shit. Lay it evenly. And put it in the pan and watch how that bitch tell him. It's a salt. You want to get want to get free. I know you the flavor Yeah, I know you. I believe what you get you a flavor mayonnaise. Hell yeah! Go ahead, G. Pick your three. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do pancakes, bro. Cause first, I'm gonna have to do pancakes first. I'm gonna have to do pancakes first. I'm picking pancakes first too, by the way. And then waffles. I'm gonna your leg on the bed when you I'm gonna do I'm gonna do waffles second. Like, what's wrong with that? <laughs> what you mean by yeah, that? Yeah. You supposed nigga, to bend over? Yes, nigga, put your lotion on like a man. You don't put your I'm leg up on nothing. I'm not bending over, nothing. bro. I'm not but bending it's really over. not a full <laughs> bend. It's a squat and a bend as no, a man. See, I don't even want to Are you lifting you up like this while you standing? No. Are you, are you, I'm you sitting on the bed. Down? You dip? My dry, you sit down? My dry towel spread but that bitch across the bread and I sit down. Nah, nah. But I ain't yeah, my. Yeah, so you putting your leg up? I got a phobia with my. I do that my, in the tub too. So I'm a, so what you mean? What do you mean? Put your leg. Where you put your leg? Put your leg up on the side of the table. On the edge of the bed. Or I squat down. When I'm washing my leg. Yeah. I ain't talking about. I lift that bitch up. Clean your ass is your responsibility. I lift that bitch up. How you apply lotion? You're not supposed to like, be putting your leg up. Like, I mean, like that's I'm in the, listen. You I'm wear a tie oh, towel around your leg. Listen, listen, listen. I'm a skinny nigga. So if I squat, pause. That you, shit is. 
We don't need that bitch of a visual. Right. Uh, so I'm saying. You so I'm right, saying. Right. Right. I'm not, right. So I'm, right. I'm, I'm wrong. not bending over or ain't no times <laughs> where it's going to be air going on my backside. <laughs> you going right. on right. my behind. I'm sitting down. I'm sitting down. Oh, you right. I'm sitting down. Now, if my leg up, I'm, I, can, I can hit my, my feet. Wait, do you sit on the bed? or I'm sitting on the bed. I'm sitting on the bed. I got a chair around. Sitting on the bed is still a little feminine to me. I'm sitting on the bed. 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 I'm I'll be sitting on the toilet. You're not supposed to sit on nothing soft with your ass out. That's just the way I think. And I feel like, I feel like. Yeah, like when I get out the shower, no, bro, I'm putting on no boxes I immediately. I feel like. Immediately, it's your, your post to, but it's yeah. me. It's so sassy ass me around no, here. No, when, when I get like, out. I walk around the house naked all day. Me no, 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 no. When I get out, I'm going, my, I'm, going, I'm going to the room. Yeah, men who walk around. And I'm oiling up. No, I'm saying you can't do that. Walk yeah, around the house naked all boxes night? On. Nigga, as a man, you are not supposed to be naked too long. Like, it's boxes a rule on. in the Bible. No man it's a rule. Down, no man <laughs> shall be naked. naked. All day? Yes. That's my problem with, that's what I'm saying. Day. Boxers on, I mean. Yeah, shit. boxers on, yeah. Yeah, your boxers yeah, on, cool, yeah. yes. I'm talking about, he, boxes like, he and mean socks like socks. ass booty naked. You bo- booty yeah. naked at the crib. Hell, he said, nah, yeah. I mean, not now. I got kids, <laughs> but I'm saying you was booty. That was your thing? It ain't all day, but it's like. King Freak 8. <laughs> King Freak 8. Bring your ass inside. Once I'm about to once I'm about to sit down and chill though, you know, I put I'm gonna put some drawers on So you just walk on. around a lot? Bro, I done walked around the house naked, but it'll be like ready? if I I had to have just got out the shower, I needed to go do something like it ain't nothing that important. Kissing. Go put some drawers on. No, I'm saying head. if I had to hurry up and open the oven. Look, 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 I had to hurry up and go open the hey, oven. Hey, my pause. Man, my, when did somebody kick the door open to rob you? They, you they, naked. They, They're they gonna said, shoot you. They said. I, they said I mean, the homie said, big boy. Shoot me if I they, no, they, they if you got boxes, you will be spared. But if you somebody no, kick your door they open, you ass naked. The homie big boy. They're gonna shoot you. The homie big boy. Somebody tried to rob his crib. He pulled out, scrape booty ball naked. Find that pistol with the nigga. That me Cause what if you in the middle of fucking And somebody breaks into your crib You ain't about to find no drawers No towel I am Before you shoot me sir. Can I please get some drawers <laughs> <laughs> If you gonna kill me Can I Don't send me out to the hospital like that Don't do the corner That's like funny. that I, I had somebody say that to me too Cause I, 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 I sleep naked yeah, like, 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 my worst what, what, what if the house catch on fire? Like, like I'm gonna put some clothes on the house. I'm gonna grab some shorts. Ain't supposed It don't take that long to throw the clothes yeah. on. No, it don't. I'm throwing bitches on out the house. I'm definitely not walking around this bitch. One of my worst fears. This is real shit. One of my worst fears. And I just y'all my friends. I see y'all as friends. So I want all y'all to do this. If you witness me in this position, if I'm fighting. And my ass end out for any reason. We'll help you out. Pull shoot in the air, jump that nigga, do something. So let me in my, that fight. Let me get myself together. In that fucking fight. That's my worst fear. I'm going to get the fight and my ass going to be out. <laughs> I'm traumatized. I be seeing them videos on Instagram. Some people think that shit funny. I be in the comment section. Y'all some fuck ass niggas for laughing like this because there's people out here with real fear. Like, I ain't <laughs> scared. Bro. I can't. Hell no. Nah, my ass on World Star. Buy ass a war, bro. No, shoot in the air. Fuck losing the fight, huh? Fuck, fuck losing the fight. <laughs> yeah, I lost. Even if I win, I lost. <laughs> oh, what? Uh, what you want? You good? What about the throw? Did he do all his? Yeah, what? He did all his? He did all his? He, he said, he just said. Y'all don't think chicken and waffles is fire? Like fried chicken and waffles? Yeah, but listen, I didn't start eating chicken and waffles until. That's like, a brunch meal. That's sassy, too. That that's shit, a brunch though. meal that ladies that made pop. That's sassy. That shit. No, I'm just joking. Oh, no, no, but look, though, look. I grew up eating that shit. But women did make it popular. <laughs> I'm about to say, I did of it is, because I ain't never just got no chicken and waffles. I fuck around with pancakes and French toast. Waffles is like. I grew up eating waffles. And but yeah, yeah I can chicken. see that though. You, you yeah. in Cali? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, so them niggas do that. Oh yeah, they do that heavy. They eat some yeah. egos and shit. I ain't never. That's not Milwaukee. what they mean. No cap. <laughs> you ever shit. had chicken and waffles in Milwaukee? In Milwaukee, I never had that shit. I ain't never. As I a kid, I didn't no, get no, that no. shit. Till I got no, grown. I ain't get that shit. That's what I'm saying. A lot of people have. Chicken and waffle got real popular. I had it after COVID. Yeah, for yeah, for sure. With brunch, it got popular after COVID. Nigga, I done had some fish in like, no, I, I like it before. They man. are drinking mimosas at an Y'all ever had breakfast? Rate. Yeah, facts on my life. Going crazy. <laughs> They got What's 96 ounce towers. What's some shit called flights? What's some shit called flights? They got 96 ounce towers. Mimosas and hookahs. I don't Piss going to be crazy. the color of banana Kool-Aid. Yeah, bro. They don't give a fuck. Piss is going to be supersonic <laughs> yellow. 
<laughs> that is crazy. Yeah, okay. That's the other reason Drink why I, some I don't water. want that fresh Listen, out the. But that's I why want... you can't eat pussy all day. No, but I was going to say that's, that's why it's still enough nutrition and pussy <laughs> to eat it all day. That's a damn lie. Hell that's God. why I don't want the chicks with the fresh pussy every time. Pussy though. is the oven to turn your semen into a whole goddamn child. Yeah. That's pussy. That don't mean gotta, you feel me? That's why I want women to stop worrying about that little stomach part. Look, bitch, pussy needs protection. That's what that stomach <laughs> what is. What they call there it? For. The fupa? You are holding on to something very valuable. And they be mad, like, damn, why I can't lose this little part? Because it's from God. <laughs> he gave it to me. How much weight? You ever seen a girl know how much weight she lose? She could be slim. But she got that little pouch right there. That's pussy protection. That little kangaroo pouch. That is pussy protection. Just in case a fuck nigga come trying to hit something, they'll hit the bumper first. Look at it. Hit the bumper first. Hey, a pussy need a bumper on it. It's man, pussy is valuable as shit. Y'all really don't understand how good pussy is sometimes. Shit. Like niggas be wanting to argue with <laughs> niggas be wanting to argue with women on podcasts. Can we just have a moment for no, everybody no to tell what is your favorite part of pussy? No bullshit. Like me on my favorite part is the initial slide in. If I if I made a sex tape, I would on for my feelings of pussy. It'll only be 0.2 seconds long. It'll be me going in and me coming out and me going in again. That is the most enjoyable. The first slide in of vagina is so magical. Think for a second. Have you ever thought about how you can't stop thinking? For that 0.2 seconds, <laughs> you, ever, you, ever you think? don't think nothing. How you can't stop You can't thinking? stop thinking. <laughs> you can't stop thinking. Even as you talk, you're thinking. Yeah. When you first slide in pussy, it ain't a thought. When you first slide in pussy in the first three seconds of climax, and as a man, a bitch could kill you, and it's nothing your body could physically do. If you and me and that nigga, it is over. It's done. That's the only. That's the weakest moment of a man in existence of your manhood. When you bust, you out of nigga. Here. The house can catch on fire. You can't run <laughs> nowhere until that action is over. <laughs> it has to be over. But women fuck around and figure that out. They'll fuck us up. They'll fuck us up. That point two seconds is a motherfucker. What's your favorite part? And you can't say mine. Mine is slide in. I took it out. Okay. Okay. Mine, mine is the grab. When oh, my God. What's the grab? Oh, you ain't had the grab? Oh, the snatcher. The I got, snatcher. We just, I'm country. We call it something oh, different. We call it that, gra- that grab. When the motherfucker. Me and grab. Women snatch. Just to Whatever you want to call it. When the motherfucker <laughs> clinch up. <laughs> if you want to call it clinch. Whatever you want to call it. That's a good one, too. A yeah. clinch. That's a sexy word. Tighten. Tighten. Tight, tight, yeah. yeah. Muscle. Tighten. Oh, I call it grip. 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 Yeah. That's very masculine. You're talking about pussy. Have some fucking respect. <laughs> talking about grabbing. That's what's wrong. Pussy etiquette is important. They call their hands the grip or when they get their nails done. The oh, grippers. the grippers, that's made for gripping. That's the hand, but the vagina is supposed to have a more intimate name. So what y'all like, call it? Again? So the clinch, we're going to call it clinch, the clinch. The clinch. Gonna, when they clinch that motherfucker, mm. that motherfucker, that's real. That's a good one, boy. Well, I'll, I'll that's real answer, life. Man. That's real that's life. One. That was my answer. You can't think of nothing else. You only got one favorite thing about pussy. You're in a horrible, horrible place with vagina, sir. <laughs> it's a bunch of good ones. No, the first bitch you got away. My favorite, nigga. When, I'm, uh, I'm with what you said damn. at the end. When I'm, when I'm, yeah, when I'm leaving it in. Oh, the, the stain. He said we're not leaving the stain it. Is, stain. That nigga got a lot of kids, so he's scared to even say it. <laughs> I don't even want her to hurt come in. <laughs> Cause there's nothing a man can do to compete with. Baby, come in me. Nigga, you a fuck say fuck responsibilities. <laughs> no bullshit. No bullshit. I'm in there. You damn about to shoot right then and there when I'm she said. A lot of niggas got babies oh, with hoes. Oh. No bullshit. With full fledged hoes. <laughs> The whole no, it's a percentage they might get pregnant because they fucking. Niggas going crazy. You talk about the masculine nigga. That's when I feel the least masculine. But I don't give a fuck. Oh, when you come in, oh nigga, the sound. (laughs) (laughs) Nigga, I done made niggas. Some niggas pretend they quiet. <laughs> nigga, I am so loud. Nigga, I didn't try. I tried. I don't give a, 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 a fuck if your kids. I tried to be quiet. I, I was like, yeah, this nigga, no I could be boys. fucking it's in a room next to my mama. Listen. If it's one of them good ones, because sometimes ain't, ain't everything hey, ain't an all moment. It ain't. But when you done had a good stroke and you know you done gave us some good dick, you done lasted without having to dismount. So you just been fucking straight. <laughs> you been fucking straight. Your dick working with you tonight. Like, this damn, I ain't bust yet. I ain't had to pull out of here. And she say, and you finally get to that feeling. And she say, don't don't pull out. 
Oh, bitch. Oh. I'm done right then. <laughs> I, that's what I'm saying. I'm done right then. As soon as she said, as, as soon as she get with the last, or however she worded, whatever the last sound to the last letter. Edit that shit out. Got to be shit. talking about pussy. This nigga over here slurping on Twisted. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about pussy. He's slurping on twisted tea. Cause he don't want to get it on his shorts. Nigga, let it get on the shorts. Don't you slurp that on camera? What is wrong? You wasn't enjoying at all. This is a leather couch. Fuck that couch. Fuck that couch. Oh my god, bro. Fuck that couch. I can't even look at you no more. Can't look you in the eyes of a nigga slurping on twisted tea. <laughs> like I looked at the couch. Oh my god! Oh, yeah, edit that out for him, man. Do that for y'all, boy. Edit Queasy. that out. That nigga's Queasy. On the couch. I'm that sorry. Nigga, get it on I'm the sorry. couch. I'm sorry, Queasy. The other day. Oh shit! <laughs> nah, fuck that. It was yesterday. <laughs> it was yesterday, bro. This nigga had one of the uh. What them uh, energy uh some kombucha whatever them bitches called kombucha kombuchas he mm-hmm. had one of kombuchas now it's, it's five hard legs in that front room we mm-hmm. up there chilling having a good conversation you know what I'm saying talking amongst men right just like this uh, shout out to Shiloh mm-hmm. and then he opened his drink right and we all talking this motherfucker gets a this nigga like a cappuccino bro, we all we look at him the conversation like, and look at this nigga like what the fuck you doing over there <laughs> <laughs> he was like, bro, what the fuck? Imagine what he do when niggas ain't around. <laughs> no, that's what the fuck you don't do. It's imagine what he do when niggas ain't around. That's what you don't do. That is horrible information. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, when you What's hear that? certain that shit, squeezes, Queasy. give him a new nickname. He cannot be named Queasy and Slurp Kambucha. Slurp Kambucha. <laughs> Oh my goodness. What is wrong? My lips don't even nickname. do that. How do y'all lips still do that? That, that shit turned off of me when I was 18. <laughs> <laughs> when I turned 18, a lot of shit just stopped happening. I didn't slurp nothing else. But hey, pussy. Hey, I blew, <laughs> I blew my. Hey, these niggas though, but I blew my kids' mind when I had told them. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, dad, you should suck his thumb, bro. And they was like, what? <laughs> You used to do what? Why would you tell them that? Yeah, I didn't get no fuck. You know what I'm saying? My mom and them gonna tell them regardless. They was, you know what I'm saying? And I'm sitting in my dorm room bed, laying down, trying to take a nap for my last class before I gotta go to practice. My roommate and his girlfriend walk in. You sucking your damn. And I got my thumb in my mouth, and this little white hole say, she made that. What is your what is your roommate doing tucking his thumb? Nah, and I heard it. I was like, ah, oh, I done got caught thumb sucking. <laughs> your brain was going fuck. out. Thumb um, sucking department going geez, crazy. Fuck. <laughs> I'm mad than a bitch. I instantly popped that boy out of my mouth, got up, just popped up and grabbed my boot bag and just left out the room. <laughs> You must have did something masculine like go chop some wood or something. <laughs> I, I did not like, suck my thumb again since that day, bro. And it's my crazy. Dad is damn it's sixty and still you suck his It's thumb. crazy because I went home and my mom would kill like kept on looking at me weird. And I was like, Why? what's wrong? She was like, I ain't seen you suck your thumb since you've been home. And I was like, I right, stopped. She was like, What made you stop? And I told the story. She was like, You gonna do it again, but I never did it again. It was like an instant was like, Oh no, I can't. You probably do it while you sleep. That little fifteen nah. percent that's still. Uh, no, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you what I do do. I'm gonna tell you what I do do. I'm I'm tell tell you. You what I do do. I used to, I used to, I used to, uh, like, 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 the the top part of your, 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 you know what I'm saying, your shirts and shit. Chew on them. Or no, no, no. Or these parts of your pants and shit, like these big parts, or the mm-hmm. parts of the pillows that got like real. I still find it with the hoes. You know what? You, My kids' mom do the same thing. She, but she used to suck these two fingers, and she got this blanket, nigga. We done moved and everything. To this day, it's a little silk part on this blue blanket, that she and that's what she rubbed. She fumbled. I still do that shit to God, I thank God I didn't have issues like that. Oh, Sucking yeah. my thumb. Yeah, bro. I can't that have titties crazy. and suck my thumb. That would be <laughs> fucking wild. Thank you, Lord. Thank, yeah, you, Lord. Like, yeah, thank you, Lord. Like, thank you. Like, we don't thank God for the important things. <laughs> I be seeing people with a fat bill that I thank God that I don't have that fat bill. Oh, no bullshit. I take the ice cream cone all day because once I lose weight, it's going to even out. But nigga who got hips, them hips are there forever. <laughs> The more weight you lose, the thicker the bitch you gonna become. No bullshit. Can't be no thick bitch as a grown man. 
You trying to hit a bitch from the back, your ass clapping. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> God got a sense of humor, bro. And I thank God he wasn't on no funny business when he made me. Oh, I'll take a wider back over a wider a wider set of hips any day. Any day. I think everybody I, gotta, I think man. everybody beautiful, right? Everybody beautiful. Fuck that. No, everybody right. ain't everybody, beautiful. Everybody Stop beautiful right. Right. But I'm gonna tell you one yeah. body shape that I look at and I laugh and I hate that I laugh because it's just it's it's like I, I don't wanna think of people like that because nigga being a dark skinned dude with skinny nigga I had bad skin young know, mm. nigga glasses nigga we talking about talked about nigga I was a the the peer I was, you said I was dark skin was bad I, I, what then back then I was a peer mediation of jokes be dark skin and fat nigga, so booty scratcher, right? oh yeah I was everything <laughs> but when I see not even a woman it could be a man when they have like the bodybuilder back and they like stupid big breasts or a big nigga with a big old chest or like huge or whatever and then they butt sink in. Nigga, are you those, talking about me? No. Why are you next to me? Why are you next to me? You gonna sit here and describe me. You gonna sit right here the fuck next to me and describe. Wait, what if this go viral and a whole bunch of people see this shit? Nigga, you just could have said ice cream cone and left it at that. When the booty suck in and the bitch real wide in. Whatever them kids said to you about your charcoal black ass, you deserve it. <laughs> you deserve it. You deserve it. I hope they called you ungodly things. Oh, you brisket skin ass nigga. <laughs> hot, hot dog side down. You gonna really sit here and describe me like that? You invited me to your home? I done shot you a promo video and tagged you in it? <laughs> Made you laugh and entertained you for you to sit there and use your evil in that way. Oh, I hope the oh next time God. you get your hair twisted, that bitch get a cramp. She get a cramp and she only get a quarter of it done. And you got to walk around <laughs> with great parts in one corner of your head for a whole day. Oh, my God. I hope you get to the last bite of your favorite Gross. meal and see a pubic hair on the plate. Oh, <laughs> That's the craziest shit right there. Oh I hope right before you get ready to slide in, your shit just fall. Don't even get up no more. <laughs> No, nah, I'm just fucking with you. But that's oh evil. That God. is some Doctor Evil. That he, like I'm no. listening to him describe, and I'm like, Bro, okay. Then my no, brain Reggie. is telling me, Reggie, he's describing you. <laughs> <laughs> then he got the butt sunk in. I tell everybody, I'm like, I don't worry about jail. My butt look. I ain't gonna track nobody. <laughs> God had to go to the bathroom, put my booty in the scrunchie, left. And I passed down the line with it still on. <laughs> and I thank God for that, cause men ain't supposed to have a booty. You're supposed to have a behind. <laughs> but finish your um description of these people you hate, <laughs> aka just rigid. I, ain't never I hate eyes. your bitch. Ah, you got four eyes. Shut up. You knew what you were describing. <laughs> behind, before. Every time I see you, it's front facing you on the mic, making motherfuckers laugh and shit. So, nigga, I ain't never uh, looked at you from the back. In. Bruh, but you do, hey, bro. My the kids a. make jokes about it. Say, I'm just thighs. They be like, Richie, go sit your thighs down. <laughs> well, Ross yeah. say, we got thighs. That nigga's got two legs. <laughs> two, two legs in the back. My daughter, my, daughter, my daughter told me I look like that giant thing of home for imaginary friends. The oh, tall the motherfucker. Tall yeah. The red. It ain't on my legs. Oh, no. Man, that nigga say he's tall in the bed. Nigga. Uh, That's I, crazy. Hey, you didn't hit the nail on the head until so you said butt sucking. I said, this nigga, this nigga ain't shit. You evil. Hey. You evil, G. Hey, no. Eddie, you I evil. evil. It's, it's only crazy because I clearly, nigga, I'm never. Oh, I man. never look. Oh, I man. never look clearly like you know what I'm saying. But I, I really, it really only be on women. It be like, oh man, like so whoever with you, they really love you. 
You know what I'm saying? All them women got that belly part like Shamar right here. And they got them big ass teeth, but they legs like crackheads. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I can see the veins Somebody really from their thighs Somebody down to their ankles. But they look big, but they little. It's just their titties is huge. And they got that Shamar mid gut thing. Somebody love you, bro. Like, because Shamar, you know, Shamar mid gut, it stick out. <clears throat> like, he can't even get fat. It's like, like, that is real love, or you getting cheated on. <laughs> that could be it, too. That could be it. It's fucked up, but you know what I'm saying? Remember, get that pussy first if you catch your cheating. Because cheating yeah. pussy is the best. That's top tier. That is meth level for pussy addiction. Catch her cheating and she guilty? <laughs> She gonna suck your dick every time you do something. Every Man, time. I gotta go get some cereal. You want some head before you go? Every time. I'm telling you, if a woman cheating, she get caught. Fire and square, do not leave her immediately. You got at least five days of some of the greatest sex you can no, ever No, really, experience. really, you got about a month. Nah, I ain't gonna go a month because you cheated before. Five yeah, days is the max, nigga. If you cheated before, at least once, five oh, days is. Oh, okay. If you if you did it first, yeah, because then it's gonna kick in. She gonna snap out of that shit and be like, "Well, when he cheated, he wouldn't eat my pussy every day." Now you got an argument. Now you got to fuck back. You don't want to be in a fuck back predicament. You ever had been offered some pussy when you really didn't want it? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, that's a horrible feeling. It's a, it's, a, it's a bad place to be. It's a horrible place. You will spit in your hand and throw it up that bitch back and pretend you met it. I, I, I told them I've done I don't know what you did That's what I did I've done plenty of things <laughs> I didn't To fake one To get up out of there Yeah Hell yeah sure. Pussy is, <clears throat> It looks so ugly When you don't want none <laughs> <laughs> You, you wanna put that on me you For real When well, you don't want it <laughs> You wanna put that on me <laughs> What she say? Well, that's nasty. Why it look oh, like that? Why it look like that? Why it look like that? He say, yeah, that's real. Nigga, yeah, people make a joke out of it. After you bust up after watching porn, nigga, you really do be disgusted with that shit. Like <laughs> you close the screen, you slam the screen down. Or right, some people they they want to get off so bad they don't even close the tab. They just slide their thumb up and leave the Safari, leave the Safari app. Now you open your phone up Ooh. 10 minutes later, it's a whole fucking pussy on your screen. Like, nigga, be polite to yourself. Close that tab. You're done. <laughs> You're done. Close that tab. You oh let that nigga God. tear you, bro. I know I look better than that nigga. Man, that's like leaving a porn tape in the VCR. Bitch, it's children here. Take that out of there. <laughs> that's scary, though. Hey, that listen. is a very... Go to school. I was a morning nigga. Like, if I'm a jack, I'm a jack off first thing in the morning before I go to school. Pop that porn <laughs> tape in so I can take it. I have enough, I have enough time to take another bath. So I have enough time to jump in the shower, go wipe up. Nigga, one day I went to school and left that porn tape in there. Nigga, I got suspended to get home before my mama did. <laughs> no bullshit. That ass whooping like, oh, is shit. way easier than her turning on that TV because we ain't have cable. Hey, and our TV didn't have signal. Y'all used to get paddles at school? Hell yeah, corporal punishment as they call it. Yeah. Hell yeah, they used to have fun with it. Y'all had the uh, had card names. The card thing, the, the color. Local. You get on like a certain. Oh, like you get on green, blue, red, green. I yeah. passed out. Whenever hit. I did something, I was immediately on the works. Y'all got hit in school? Hell, Hell yeah. yeah. How old are you? That's the South shit. They said, damn. You yeah. should have been around that time. They you weren't doing that shit. That's South shit. They weren't doing that shit. Oh, yeah. Shit. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get shot in California. Yeah, you should have been beat up. Like, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah. You California's my uncle, uh, my, beat my, uncle, my cousin was a principal. Yeah, and my and my grandma's worked all my grandma. Yeah, I mean there was only school. one grade, like first grade, where my aunt was my teacher. She was with me, but like that's your aunt though. Yeah, that's my aunt. Like yeah, the fact that not, they were letting grown that's men crazy. And little kids. That's with crazy. Wood with a paddle, and that's how I know we don't know who to vote for. And it's, it's <laughs> nothing we do. No bullshit. Because how the fuck? I wish you would. Man, who, my daughter. who is this nigga? I don't give a fuck who it is. Who like, is this nigga? You think you for have you lost kid? your mind? I will. But they say that's what's wrong with us. They really think whooping. Like these people, grown people who think whooping is why they whoopings is why they're a good person. Do you know how fucking Kunta Kinte that fucking sounds as an adult to say I'm a better person because my mama whooped me? I would never say no stupid shit like that. <laughs> I probably helped her release some stress and kept her from killing her fucking self. Having a heart attack type shit. Or a fucking aneurysm. So she got the release. Some trauma. She got the release on me. Mm-hmm. Kind of creation. But to say I to say I got whooping. my ass whooping, that made me a better person. That is some stupid shit to say out loud. I got my ass whooped for shit that I I should have got my ass whooped for. Yeah. 
I got think, my ass whooped for shit that I should have done, but not got caught. I didn't get a whooping because I, mean, I got yeah, 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 yeah. I got a whooping because I got caught. I got caught. Yeah. Yeah, I got some caught, things but, you yeah. got to experience. Fucking if it's some pussy available and you fifteen, I would, mom, you train me to be smart, right? I'm a young man, right? I got a dick, and this motherfucker get hard, right? It's some pussy available. I would be stupid to turn that down. I think you now got, I'm getting my ass whooped. I ain't getting some pussy. I ain't getting. I shouldn't have got caught. I ain't getting crazy thing. When, like my mom used to let females come over to the crib. So like I ain't. Why did you live? But I'm telling you, my, my, but my mama had me. She was 16, so it was different. Oh yeah. So like I can have females come to the crib, but like when she found out that I started having sex, I can only have them downstairs type shit. Does she so, think you wouldn't fuck downstairs? I, but she, we but it was, I say I, I community lived, so it was always five, six people who lived at the crib. So it was always probably somebody there. Like, but it was only certain hours throughout the day where they wasn't there. You know what I'm saying? But they are sliding, whatever the case may be. So like, when it came to fucking shit, when she found out I was fucking, she just she ain't do shit. She went to the store, bought me and this nigga Larry, nigga. Two big boxes of condoms. And was like, How much fucking did she think you was about to I don't know. But, the, but them bitches was there today, damn near, damn near. Because I told you from, from 11, after that first time, 12 until 13, I ain't fuck again. You feel me? Until I was 13. So, like, it was just. But she well, was. She knows you fucked after the first time? Yeah, because what happened was, nigga, Larry, Larry's sister had. Larry and Julie was in an argument. My mama and my 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 mama and they mama was playing fifteen hundred on at the table at my house. Me and Larry right there chilling playing Uno. I remember she like it was yesterday. Julie was sitting there chilling watching some uh, TRL or something, uh-huh. and fucking they ass arguing. And then she like and you and Larry was like and you jumped out the window and went over my quail house type shit. And then she like you and you you and Chuck had uh had sex with uh what uh, what unique cousin. And they asked us playing cards, and they asked, like, they did what? And we looked at Julie and was like, bro, your ass wild for even. Damn, so he ratted you out? You ain't, no, nah, the sister ratted us out. So, like, you know what I'm saying? Then my mama, my mama looked at me and she like, did you do that? I'm like, my shit, we was playing with money. I told the whole thing, like, we was playing with Monopoly money and. And shit, she was just like, give her this and she gonna do this. And shit, I gave it to her. And yeah, like, I got my first piece of pussy for a box of goddamn oatmeal pies. I guess this <laughs> bitch parent went by her doing snacks. She wasn't even fat. But her parents was poor. Wait, they didn't have snack cakes. Wait, your first piece of pussy you basically paid for? No, basically. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little daddy with, with, with some oatmeal. I, but I didn't pay for them, so technically I ain't paid for nothing. I just had access, and it was an opportunity. <laughs> I got these at the crib. Yeah, 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 my stepdad used to buy a hell of snack. Nigga, you know what I mean? It's shit, nigga, I made groceries at their house, basically. I can get some hair if I bring you this. Nigga, got two liters of Sprite. My mama like, where did these two liters come out? Grandma gave me got one. <laughs> Shit, I make up anything. I'm knee deep in some pussy for a I two liter. I don't fuck how many people live in the house. There's two things I can sneak, food and pussy. I can open up a snack cake in a funeral, nigga, and they'll never even know. <laughs> I'm talking about the box and the wrapper <laughs> at a funeral. And nobody oh, will never know. Oh my god, bro. Oh my shit, god. Shit, it's real with this snack assassin shit. Oh my god, bro. Did no. everybody do their pancake waffle French toast? I, I don't know. I ain't good. You ain't good. I, I waffles know. last for me. French toast is last for me only because I'm not an egg eating nigga. So French when, toast ain't good. So when niggas what? dipping the bread into the egg, I, I was like, like for a OB. long time, I did not like that shit. Cause I'm like, I, I put it in that cool. egg, bro. I don't even like eggs. Hell, no. If it ain't OD amount of egg, yeah, I'm good. I, just, I want that brioche French toast, and it need to be that thick. Yeah, it need to be yeah. cooked perfect. Yes, sir. I don't like that Texas toast, French toast, because it get too soggy. Yeah. It ain't real bread for one. Yeah, that brioche you need is to crazy. have real bread. I don't know what that, is. That yeah, Texas yeah, toast, when you guy, drop it in that little egg mix, that should get soggy. Like it absorbs it. That brioche yeah. don't absorb. It's airy. Oh, so it just it really cooks yeah. the perfect way. But yeah. I don't care for French toast. Well, why would I want French toast in this pancakes and waffles around? For sure. I'm taking them waffles. I mean, I'm fr- I'm French. Waffle ain't a dish you gotta wash either. I'm taking so them, you know what I'm saying? You I'm can wipe the waffle them. iron off and it's done. I'm taking them Other pan- shit you gotta pancakes wash. with crispy edges specifically. And buttery. I'm, I'm French toast, pancakes, I'm waffles. 
French toast. French toast first. Damn. Damn. Exactly. Damn. He lived a great life. <laughs> he did. <laughs> he did. Damn. He a different you nigga. I always nigga, had like we a made. I made it day. though. I had to make it. It wasn't like we just bought it. I made it. Just your mom made French toast growing up. Yeah, she showed me how to make it. I'm such a creative mom. My mom didn't get creative until I moved out. <laughs> my, my creativeness was, was cutting some shit. strawberries and throwing on the pancakes. That was creative. No, nothing. Just the strawberry on the pancakes? Just cutting some strawberries up and putting that bitch on the That's pancake. So that, the pancakes. that was creative. But so then it's crazy. It's crazy because this is how this nigga Larry became my brother. The first night I, we moved into the crib, me and my mom was up on the floor in sleeping bags on game. And this nigga, we played all day outside and shit like that. And the nigga was like, can I see at your house? This nigga stayed right next door. My address was 52 West. His was 48 West. He stayed right next door. Nigga, I spent at my crib. I'm like, bro, we ain't got shit in here. No couch, no beds, no nothing. Nigga, he's like, I got a sleeping bag. Nigga, all right, fuck it. First time I'm... ignorant kids first, don't leave a bed to go sleep in a sleep in a, a sleeping bag. <laughs> it was the first time my mama had made strawberry pancakes with the strawberry in a batter. So when mm, she made that's it... That's different. When she made it, I'm looking at her like, damn, what made you? Just because this nigga spending the night? Like, you should have been made this for me. <laughs> oh, yeah, mama show I'm the out. Only kid, she, bro. Like, you should have been made. Mama show out when people me, come bro. stay the like, night. Because she. Cause, Cause the kids gonna go back home Gonna go yeah. home and tell them <laughs> Now every bitch on the block Gonna step they pancake game up Your mama is a superhero nigga That's what you don't understand I was mad that the bitch Shit. about five minutes Like god damn nigga uh, you made been mad, mad nigga. Just invite like, Larry mad. over more you often. Unappreciated. <laughs> Your mama just made strawberry pancakes. Now I was seven years old and I still remember that feeling. I was being mad because so I was like, nigga, I've been on this earth for a minute. You ain't never made this like this for me. Nigga, my mama used to make this shit on Wednesday called sweet and sour pork chop. I break my switch when I get off the bus. <laughs> Beat my ass so I can go to bed. I'm not eating that shit. Sweet like and that's sour. The, that's the first time I ever stood up to my parents. I am not eating. It's just, nigga, it ain't even sweet and sour. I mean, a <laughs> sweet or whatever it is. It's baked pork chop, and it got the bell pepper and onion on top. And you know when you bake pork chop, it get that little white pussy shit yeah. that be around. And then the meat fold, the Once I seen, once fold I fold seen that, shit. I'm never eating that. So for the first few years, she used to force me out to eat it. After I got about six or seven, I think I broke the switch, beat my ass. I'm not eating that shit. And I don't eat that shit to this day. I don't bake my fucking pork chop. All the time you no. use the... Bitch, put that in some grease. <laughs> shit. <laughs> I always make hamburger steaks. You really couldn't just make me a hamburger? As a, as a kid, I didn't appreciate them. Now that's one of my favorite meals. A hamburger steak, some gravy on hey, that Hey, the Salisbury steak mama, shit? My Nigga. mama. Black mama's a oh, magic. hell no. Salisbury steak. Man, black mama's See, a you magic. think about the Hungry Jack Salisbury You don't eat steak. Salisbury steak? Oh, you have a real hamburger steak where you make a hamburger patty and you let that bitch, you, you sear it and then you simmer it in I'm the gravy, in the homemade gravy. So don't, gravy from don't think about the homemade no gravy, John. He don't fuck with gravy. Hell no. no don't, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> don't you ever go back to Mississippi. Don't you ever go back. What did he say earlier he don't do? He don't, he don't eat do gravy. He don't do a lot of shit, bro. Uh, he don't eat a lot of shit. Tea. Ooh, he don't drink tea? <laughs> you don't drink tea and you don't eat gravy? That nigga go get a quesadilla with nothing but chicken. Cheese. No cheese? Chicken and cheese. I mean, che chicken and cheese. That's it. Hey, man, you live a rough life. <laughs> <laughs> now I understand all that pain in your All music. that anger. <laughs> you are angry and you don't even know it. The angry. Release that, that, release that <laughs> shit and try more. Nigga, what you mean you shit. don't like gravy? That shit nasty, bro. Nigga, that's impossible. No, it's not. <laughs> the seasoning that's on the meat that you like so about the meat. Did you have some bad gravy, gravy before? Mm -hmm. There's some bad gravy out there though, because I was oh, like, oh yeah, some bad gravy. I didn't like gravy I've never when I was had Salisbury steak. Once I have yeah. it and you fuck it up, it's over. Yeah. That's amazing. We put that analogy on it. Once we had it, we fuck it up. That's crazy. It's crazy. It's over. We, only if we applied that to people, <laughs> we'll save ourselves so much time with stress. So what Duh, I was like that too. I didn't like gravy when I was a kid. It's cool like now. French now. toast. I'm not like y'all no more. <laughs> no, like I, I eat right gravy now. now. I eat gravy now. Okay, when I was okay. a kid, you grew up. These yeah. bad ain't grow up. Hey, give me the. Brown I think I gravy. had bad gravy though. That's Light brown I gravy. Had bad that gravy. That's it. White gravy. gravy. Well, a lot of shit. A lot of shit. <laughs> exactly. bro, I don't like dumplings. I'm fucking dressing. some dumplings up. Fucking some dressing. What the up. fuck do you do on Thanksgiving? 
Make turkey. chicken Alfredo? Turkey. Eat turkey. Turkey. Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. <laughs> you feel me? It's chicken spaghetti. Yeah, You're going to be shitting them pebbles. You need that dressing. A whole, that broth. Whole that thing side of, overnight. Uh, whole thing of uh, cranberry sauce. Nigga, my grandma started making her dressing on Tuesday. I'm all, yeah, they go crazy for sure. But my you, grandma got you, the best you, dressing. You, you, the miss, you missed the point that he said he don't eat dressing, but then he just said a whole thing of cranberry that wasn't the you point. You eat the cranberry sauce on what? Just by itself, mm-hmm. like a bowl, like Jello, <laughs> like Jello. <laughs> like, that nigga got a Chevy Capri like, stomach. That motherfucker is hard. <laughs> like Jello is crazy. My God, how do you break that down? You premeditate that? Like I can't wait for Thanksgiving to eat a bowl of cranberry sauce. I know I'll go <laughs> buy that shit. I would go. That's some shit would have got me a whooping in my. I go buy that shit. Like, I remember I made a sandwich yeah, with honey today. buns one time. My mama whooped me. I'm like I was gonna eat two honey buns anyway. She's but because I made a sandwich out of it, now I done committed the ultimate crime. Luther. <laughs> But yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know, bro. I, I don't like cranberry sauce. That shit is cranberry I fuck sauce with it. Crazy. I'm not eating that shit plain. Though. Who else said that was nasty? Did you say cranberry sauce was nasty? Cranberry yeah, sauce is disgusting. Nasty. That shit not nasty, bro. <laughs> it's just, it's just but I'm not put eating other plain, people's bro. genitals in our mouth, and y'all are telling me <laughs> that cranberry is where you draw the fucking line. Yeah, cranberry <laughs> sauce is disgusting. The, it's the same Ooh, thing with Jello. Sh- you eat Jello, but you ain't jello. supposed to eat cranberry by itself. You supposed to take it, put, it put it on your dressing, take yeah. your fork, Mass and mix it in. in. You supposed to mix it in thoroughly. Not you got to be patient with your food. Hell no. It tastes I different do not like as an like adult. That. But as I'm a child, you, I didn't like dressing, but the cranberry, different. the sweet factor made it good. Like that I shit, wouldn't eat yeah. grits. But my grandma used to put grape jelly in it and I eat it. Man, you you eat grits with sugar or you eat no, grits with salt? No, I eat it with cheese for sure the right way, the adult way. Salt? He's talking about the adult Salt, way. pepper. Nigga, you I put eat. salt on your spaghetti or ketchup or sugar? I put. I don't put neither. Nigga, it what? It already should be on I was like, what? It's already made. I'll argue a little, you feel me? You put more salt on top? Just a little bit. You wanted to touch your tongue directly, so that's an addiction. <laughs> that's an addiction. I really only I really only eat my spaghetti with corn with cornbread though, or yep. some type of bread though. I don't eat. I can't eat that. I shit. ain't mind with ranch dressing and parmesan cheese or parmesan it. cheese for sure. But if I ain't got parmesan, I put some red. Pepper. You know, like, it's, it's, hot sauce. Red pepper it's crazy. On my pizza. It's crazy what people do with their spaghetti. The first time people make spaghetti, I want to eat it just like that. You feel mm-hmm. me? Day two, because you know you're going to eat it day two. Now I'm going to throw the hot sauce on that bit. Question. I'm going to throw it. Where you going Do you like the loose meat and the noodles here? No, fuck that. I'm not Italian. I'm a nigga. In. I want my shit mixed. I want my shit. Not even baked. You, can, just do it. you can do it in a pot. Yeah, I want you my shit You should throw some mixed. extra sauce on it. But people who separate the noodles I don't, I don't, and the spaghetti, I don't like that. I don't when like I tell it. you I hate that I don't shit. like that shit. You hate it. Especially if it tastes good. I hate them eating it. <laughs> Like my kid's mom that can make some good. good ass spaghetti. And she is separated. And she separated. That, that should be good. I don't like it either. I don't because I don't like the. It tastes. I, good. I, I feel like I'm doing the work factor. for the cooking. I hate you the milk. You know hate. that would make you slurp on the spaghetti. <laughs> Listen, the the, the 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 it not being proportionate on my plate when I and finish my plate. Do it right. When no yeah, way. when I finish my plate, Man. I got a pound of sauce. I'll be like, bro, what the fuck, scoop bro? Scoop of sauce. Like scoop of sauce and a whole plate of noodles. Hate that shit. Yeah, I hate it. And I'm send me to bed. I'm not eating this. And don't make my shit separate. I, I want sauce shit, on man. every noodle. On every, every noodle. noodle, I gang. want meat on every bite. I, you feel me? Pause. I want that shit. Yeah, pause. I want that <laughs> shit mixed in. Though, bro. I want meat on every bite. <laughs> you don't eat meat? You a vegan? Nah, <laughs> pause. Christ. I'm not a vegan. You know what I'm saying? I just said I don't eat meat. Pause. No, no, no. I don't eat meat. I'm like not doing pause. this shit no longer. Man. Pause <laughs> at the beginning of the conversation. <laughs> I'm thought you. I'm not, I thought you like vegan. That's what. I'm no, 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 no. Hey, why people be vegan want to make meat shit though? I hate that chicken wing, bitch. That's not a fucking chicken. You training that child to be stupid. Hey, listen, I ain't gonna lie. Shout out to my son Keish. That motherfucker make a mean. She make a mean meatball out of some plant based <laughs> foods. I don't know what the fuck. You know what tastes better this than nigga, that? You this nigga like them too. That? You know what tastes better than that? Even though both of y'all like them. The a fucking meatball. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm not. No, I'm, I'm not, not nigga. That's a I'm not to saying it. we. I eat them. You feel me? But I'm saying when she be making them, these bitches be like you would. Some things you would never supposed to experience. But taste. you wouldn't be able to tell. She don't put, even make if you go. What the what the women be saying when they be going to. Uh, baby shower's <laughs> awesome. Some meatballs, bitch. You better have a baby. So oh if you put, God, if you bro. put, First thing I if you put, if you put, if you put, if you put those meatballs <laughs> at the baby shower, 
they ain't gonna know that that's. If I find ain't no me, I'm gonna be pissed. You ain't gonna find out because you gonna be fucking more. Wait, you be up. asking? Nigga I, nigga, I didn't get this way by not being inquisitive. <laughs> you be a, you, usually it's the other so way around. So what's the recipe? You, you, ask, this? you <laughs> ask, is it meat in it? Yeah, I want to know. <laughs> you got to ask that in 2024. <laughs> this mac and cheese, is it, got, meat? is it meat? I need my proteins. Yes, is it vegan? What, what, vegan? What's vegan mac and cheese? Nigga, who knows? Bro, I had I had mac and cheese and broccoli. It's not made with milk. I don't like broccoli. Or real, or milk or real milk cheese. cheese. I don't like broccoli. Broccoli ain't a real plant. Anymore. My it's my shorty finessed me and put it in the macaroni and cheese. You must have been a white girl. Nah, she's, she's just trying to make me eat broccoli. And she did some ungodly shit like that. Some, she know how much I fuck you with know macaroni. How bad we'll be fighting in that house if you got one only one pan? You better have a backup pan. Oh man. no, yeah, it was. Oh, this yeah, relationship yeah, yeah, is yeah. fucking over. It was. It was definitely. You don't fuck with broccoli. broccoli. I fuck with broccoli, but separately, don't put it in my fucking macaroni and cheese. I oh, know. I had. I a, love tuna and pound I, cake, but I you may not put fucking tuna <laughs> in my pound cake. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I love broccoli. I had but a separate. <laughs> I, I had a little. I had a little Oreo back in the day. You feel <laughs> what I'm saying? And she and she. Pause. Some, what that is? I don't know. What a, the, a, um, a black chick. That, a black. A black thing. chick that grew, that, grew, that grew up around nothing but white folks. So she really like a. You know what I'm saying? She ain't really got no ethnicity about herself. She if the really, clan come back, do she, she go on a really tree? No, she going call on the tree. Call her white. Don't give her no kind of nickname. She going on the tree though. You call that white devil what she is? A white woman. But she going on the tree. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. She about your complexion. She about your complexion. But she ain't if she not white. Don't say that. Don't disrespect me like that. But listen. I'm trying to tell you when this motherfucker made a taco, she made a taco, right? Made the made the ground beef, didn't season that hoe. Put a put a put a put a piece of cheese on that bitch. You feel me? And then just put the meat on that bitch. And was like, here, I made some tacos. I was like, yo. And you stayed with her? That pussy. I didn't. That's why I'm out. Oh, I was about to say. <laughs> I did it. You bring me anything you feel me? And it's it's you feel time me? to eat. And my mind and my stomach done accepted that but, it's time to eat. And but, I can't eat. We in college, right? We in college, mm -mm. and she made that Velveeta. We got the Velveeta box, and they get mm -hmm. the the sauce and whatever, and got the the broccoli mix in that bitch. You mm. feel me? She made that bitch. That was my first time having it. I told that bitch down. I was like broccoli That's macaroni and cheese. Bro, was in college. I was you like, all right, cool. And then they, then she then she then she chopped up the little chicken breast and put that bitch in. I was she like, was creative. I was like, all right, she was Oreo. She was white. She was dark as hell. No, she was black. She was black. But she kicked it. Oh, she was black, but she, she kicked was black. It with white people. But she only she ain't That's have what Oreo. Is? I didn't know that he meant that. Yeah, that we that we call it Chicago. Oreos are great. Why are we using this to describe <laughs> <that>? Oreos? <laughs> of people, like, you you making Oreos a bad term? <laughs> yeah, you. We I guess that's. I thought it was a national thing. It's a Chicago thing, I guess. We call black folks who. I heard, I heard it. Before. We call them Oreos. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you okay. black on the outside, but you really suburban. Yeah, I know. Suburban. Uncle Tom is what we say in the you south. Feel me? Uncle Tom. Uncle Tom. I'm gonna tell y'all a term that I loved when I got down here and I moved to Texas, and I was like, "Oh, I love it." First time I heard a black nigga call a white white person a woodpecker, I fell in love. Oh wow! A peck of wood. A peck of wood. I fell in love. I say a woodpecker. That's a peck of wood. A peck of wood. That's all. I fell in. I said, "What? I gotta take that to Chicago." Bird shit is crazy. I gotta take peck of wood to Chicago, bro. Ain't nothing like peck of wood. Moon cricket is my favorite one. He called that boy a peck of wood to his face, and that nigga turned red. I screamed. I ain't gonna lie, why? I, ain't gonna I lie start though. crying, laughing, bro. I said, "Oh, they might, they might cancel, they might cancel my ass for this." They might cancel my ass for this, but it's some shit that racist white people say be funny as hell. Oh, for sure. That nigga Cory you said to say he said, I, I, "I little they cousin." They call that nigga a mud rooster. I said, "Nigga, that's hilarious." A mud rooster. <laughs> that is hilarious. I little cousin said white folks got better. Nicknames for us than we got for them, but we got better roasting like for as a combination. They can only say one name, and they might get their ass whooped out. <laughs> so, yeah, they got some good info they can say from fucking Utah. You said from info in Dallas. Yeah, that shit is funny. I got time to think about it, but if they were right here in my face. If you called me a jungle bunny. Or I'm gonna punch the shit out of you of natural nigga instinct. A porch monkey. But yeah, but if I see it on Instagram, I laugh. I'm gonna die talking laughing. about me. <laughs> they might counsel me for that. If you, can, if you lose a battle, a roast battle to a white man, you deserve. Yeah, it's over. Yeah, it's that over. You got. You should. If you can't out roast a white person, you really did, are in a lost Did you? Cause. Did you watch? Did you watch the Tom Brady roast? I haven't watched it, but I heard it was hilarious. It's this one white guy. 
on there, and I don't know his name because I don't really like white comedy, but mm. he went in on every person there, even some people in the crowd, like one by one, mm. and had me crying <laughs> tears in this front room. That's what I say, man. He had me crying like, tears. I was like, bro, who the fuck is it? And this nigga, matter of fact, oh, this nigga, T and Quest ain't right here right now, uh, Queasy ain't right here right now, but he knew who I'm talking about. Cause he be watching his little YouTube sitcom where he be bringing um not YouTube sitcom Kill Tony, Kill Tony, the gay nigga. Yeah. Then he gay? Yeah, he gay. Oh, I, I don't be in people business like that. Yeah. But he <laughs> all kind of taking references all the time. He be talking shit. But that nigga, what, watch that. Oh yeah, I watch Kill Tony. Then well, no, watch, watch the roast. The watch time. the roast though. Who? David Lucas. He be on that bitch all the time. From oh, from ADD. From, yeah. Watch the roast though. Oh damn! I didn't know that. Yeah, or yeah. Did you ain't got watch the whole Cam thing. Watch, watch the YouTube of his part. And hey, I, these mics are pretty good. Can you hear my stomach growling? <laughs> well, that bitch is roaring like that. <laughs> that bitch, that bitch. <laughs> like it just came out of nowhere. Like that first one catch you all good. Hey, it's scary. Man. I thought I was having a heart attack. It hey, bro, my you heart you remember bit. the the one joke? <laughs> I, we we you we we, we old. Mm. The one. The one joke that forever has me laughing, even when I think about it, is when that nigga on Comic View had the joke about the preacher preaching too much on Thanksgiving. Was that? I think I know. We're praying too long. I think I know. He was praying too comment. long. He said the the food was getting to his nose. Oh yeah. What's that nigga? What he got the big Bruce? eyes. Bruce? No, not Bruce. Bruce. Oh, Lavelle. Lavelle Crawford. fucking. Cr- Lavelle, that Lavelle, Lavelle hilarious. Gee, that yeah. nigga is a funny that nigga, funny nigga shit, bro. Yeah, that bro. nigga. Bro, it's hilarious. I'll never forget that joke forever because that nigga said that he was preaching. He <laughs> wanted to keep going. He said I've been already sitting here smelling the greens and the cabbage cooked. <laughs> He said that if shit. Everybody was eyes right closed. I'm gonna snip something. I'm gonna look around, make sure everybody eyes closed. I'm snipping something. I don't give a fuck what it is. A piece of squash. I hate squash, but I need some satisfaction to hold me over to this prayer is done. But that's why I was saying niggas dumb. Fat people ain't gotta worry about shit like that. Cause we already ate something in the bathroom. We done slipped something out of that kitchen and ate it in the whole closet. They got a whole chicken leg. Don't know what to do with the bone. Mama find that chicken leg six years later. <laughs> it's in the closet. <laughs> Fucking chicken under bone the behind sink. the washer. <laughs> Nigga. She found that bitch doing spring cleaning over. Yeah, well, my mama found some write ups doing spring cleaning. Listen, one time my mama just went some on some random Rambo shit. I'm like, bro, she never checked my shoe boxes. She found a, a, a progress report that I hid in my shoe boxes, nigga. And she worked at uh, Stavio Penitentiary. Then came home and just was like, <laughs> everything just that fell to the ground. Bro. We gotta get better. You ain't a good criminal. That's a good thing. We had a mobile bro. home. Because I'm like, bro, my mama never checked my shoe boxes, bro. She never. Bro, at chance. some point, you ain't throw that shit away, bro. Bro, I, I forgot. I forgot about. <laughs> it. You ever been in a mobile home? No, I ain't never like lived. Not never. living, but a been in one. I ain't never. They been cabinets in don't go to the roof because the roof do like that. It make that little that point so mm-hmm. the cabinets stick out a little bit. Somebody just added them to the wall. Mm-hmm. Nigga, I used to. I had a rubber band. I put all of my write ups above right that cabinet on a rubber band and tucked it in the back. I folded, it, tucked it in the back. Nigga, one day I'm outside playing basketball. Nigga, I see her hand. I see. I like. I know that ain't what I think it is. Oh damn! You knew what it was. Nigga, hey, lost my basketball goal. They took that bitch down and lost the parts to it. <laughs> no more hooping at Ridge House. <laughs> no more hooping at Ridge oh House. My God, it was Man, a, all my right. Took the whole goal down. That's crazy. I ain't ever. I, I used to slide my shit in the elevator at the apartment. <laughs> what kind of privileged ass <laughs> life did y'all live? Elevator at the apartment? Elevator. We had one elevator, bro. I, I don't even. It was on uh, on uh, on Lovers Lane, where, where Chris uh stayed at. Right now, where, where you the talking last... about them apartment that stink? Everybody put their tray. It's like one of them indoor elevators, like indoor um apartment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah they, they make that shit oh, like luxury. That, that shit is yeah. horrible. Yeah, that's yeah. a north thing. It was one of when, yeah. I first, <laughs> gee, when I first moved to Texas, and I seen everybody's apartments you can you can get to like a rando can come to your crib because you, your shit you is outside. Yeah. I said, bro, this some weird <laughs> shit, bro. This shit some weird because at the crib, no, it's no <laughs> access like that. Then you got a door, then you got to walk through that bitch, and then you got to get to their door, like, bro. But you can't just. 
Oh, that's that's my from Chris Crib on 421. You can see his dough. Like, nah, oh, hell no, nah, bro. That shit is wild. Wow. Grew up, born and raised in New York. Came to Mississippi for what supposed to be a summer. We laying down to go to bed. That nigga was freaking out. Why is it so quiet? Like, that nigga couldn't take our quiet anymore. <laughs> that nigga went home three days later because he was freaking out all the time. Like, they walk from a place where after 12, ain't no road, ain't no, no, no travel to road. Ain't nobody animals. out here. Nobody's outside. And that nigga could not take it. That nigga could not take it. Bro, that's why I, when I first moved here, I left Lil M because I was like, bro, this shit is too weird. I went from positive 10 to negative 10. I went from Lil M to, to well, I guess I guess they would call it the Grove. I was on. Yes, um, you did go to I was me. on. No disrespect <laughs> to the Grove. I was on Sain <laughs> I was on Sain and Buckner. Ooh. I was right by the right by the. You show was in the heart of the Grove. You was bro. in the cherry of yeah. the Grove. But it, the crazy thing come from where I'm from, it was comfortable. I was com- I was like, ah. Chicago, right? So yeah, I was like, it's comfortable. Like you know what I'm saying? I was comfortable. I was like, this shit is normal. Like I was I was Gucci, and then when my That's sons sad. moved down here, this one I was like, all right, I gotta move somewhere that's not so wild. And I'm thinking I, I moved to the north, so I moved right there. Listen, I didn't know. I didn't know either. I didn't know. Bad. I moved to the north right there by uh, cause they went to um them two schools is right back to back, right off Park. I don't step by by that seven eleven. No, 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 because they stay over there right now. But right by the uh the mall, mm. uh North Park Mall. Oh, y'all don't go over there for. Them. But that over there, yeah. it, we moved over there into that area. But it was That's a, a nice area. But it was though. Gucci because it was a whole yeah. lot of Arabs and it was it was yeah. kind of mixed. You, you feel me? Minivan. But it, it was it was it was it was kind of crazy over there. So that was pretty smooth, more so than the Grove. <clears throat> but then now they in HP. Okay, yeah, yeah. Right, you know what I'm saying? Right I, we was tricked. We yeah, was in California. Cool. And my kid's mom came down here first. And she was like, I'm going to go to the Caesar apartment. She said, he told her, Richardson. Nigga, she is on Forest Lane, walking distance from my Delia. Yeah. I said, boy, they tricked her so good. That is not Richardson. That is North Dallas. In a W F. That's what I be saying. No, when I used to rob, I'm like, nigga, this is. Bro, them niggas sell weed like heroin out there. Like, bro, you what? ever put them to a gas? Every station? gas station. Good on that gas, bro. Yes. Don't fuck around and say yes, nigga. It's like a swarm bro, of a musty of ass niggas. teenagers That's... at your window. Them niggas stand in the middle of the street, the little medium like, thing. I'm like, how the police don't get these? That's what niggas. I be saying. The police be even... out there on the nigga on Forest Lane at the mini mart. They move the sharks. Bro, it ain't sharks like a motherfucker. They they, 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 they tore it down. They tore they the whole. Tore they tore the whole. The, they tore the whole little strip down. Not just they sharks. They the tore the street. Yeah, they yeah. tore the whole the the, the mini mart. Then yeah. they tore it down and put a basketball goal. I said, "Oh, you want?" Yeah, us to I kill did each see other. that shit. I did. They put see it want us to kill and they ain't do nothing but move the shit. shark. But the crazy thing is now sharks ain't nobody ain't nobody in that sharks up the street. No, you got that one little Hispanic dude. You got. Hey, you got the mm-hmm. one who's spent. Hey, that's why I get my peace puff. When I want a peace puff from Chicago. I go that's right there. Another spot. You been to the Chicago spot down on Kingsley? You uh-uh. get your Italian beef, a piece of puff, a piece of puff, and but a hot see, dog. That's a revert to the conversation earlier. See, you ain't had Covas. Get you some Covas. Get you some grips, yeah. and then get you some Portillos. Mm-hmm. See, the thing about my fat setup, I want all three of those right now, <laughs> and now that'll be my last meal. Oh, but you like Portillos? <laughs> Portillos like burgers Portillo. is way better than Whataburger. Nigga, that's right, not easy. Right. That's not hard to do. But listen, the niggas that we was talking to yesterday said in Chicago though that Whataburger is the best bro, burgers that he ever had. Damn, incredible. Even they want incredible. Who said Whataburger was the best burger they ever had? Stop hanging with them. <laughs> You're a fucking killer. They were incredible. They, they got a weird. prison stomach. If you think Whataburger is the best stomach you a best burger you ever had, you have a penitentiary stomach. And they the never bar been, is and so they ain't low. never been to the penitentiary. The bar is so low. We're well, preparing for it. <laughs> yeah, that's what that is. That's like prison training. But yeah, Portillo. <laughs> but I go I go to Portillo's and get a big beef. Mm-hmm. I don't like that name. It's a tight. It's, it's an Italian <laughs> beef, like gang. It's an Italian you beef. I put big and shit. I gotta eat. It's an Just Italian leave beef. Leave it what it is. But listen. But listen. But listen. <laughs> hit me out. Hit me out. <laughs> hit me out. Hit me. You hit me out. Hit me out. The regular <laughs> Italian beef is like this big, right? 
don't yo, like to describe yo, it that way. Yo, yo, <laughs> yo, 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 no, because I, I can eat I'm, some shit, bro. I don't know if I'm supposed to say pause there or not. Can we get a ruling? I don't know. If the I'm whole, to say that pause. whole shit he said, it's like that. <laughs> because because he said it's like 12 inches. Because <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a French roll. It's a French roll. We talking about bread. It's a French roll mm-hmm. bread. You feel me? That's the regular And that's where it? Portillo's. Yeah. It's a Portillo registry. Right, I work the right up the street. It's me. one right there on 121. No, yeah, yeah, right, right there in Grandscape. Are they on game? Sunday? They open every day. Bob, we so close to damn what you call? I'm thinking about making that ride. I gotta check my bank account. I'm thinking about going to Hutchins. <laughs> you ever been to a place you gotta have your money right to go because you know you want everything you want? Like I want two ribs. Hutchins, Hutchins I want some fire, brisket Hutchins and fire. I want a Texas Twinkie at least two. I had one Hutch, for the I drive had Hutchins, home and one when I get there. But I'm taking Terry Black over Hutchins. This bro. nigga in this drive home. You say you taking Terry Black. Ter- I'm taking, I'm gonna tell you the I'm issue about Terry, Terry Black. Blacks. I'm they got a Terry lot of Blacks. issues that Dallas barbecue have. They cannot make sides. Like Terry, every barbecue place you think of, Bone Daddy's good, decent barbecue sides are two cheeks on a hole, ass. Two cheeks on the hole, ass. ass, ass. Sides suck. Barbecue sides out here suck. So ha- have you been around? Like have you been to different cities and states and shit and tried yeah, different barbecue? California. I live. I don't really got when it comes to barbecue, I really ain't gotta try now. I got an uncle named Cleo make the best barbecue you ever had. What's so crazy? He really my cousin. Yeah. But he's so god he's so level old. with it. He's yeah. old. He my uncle. That's what I tell you about my auntie. My daddy even called him Uncle Cleo. He's our fucking cousin. Yeah. But he's so old and he's been alive forever. Yeah. <laughs> like ever. That but do you first, but do you uh, so but but thirteen? State by state besides Uncle Cleo. We gotta hmm. take Uncle Cleo out this do you think Texas got like some good barbecue. Hell yeah. Texas got some amazing barbecue. For one, I'm here. The number one barbecue. Number one for me, it's places I ain't, I never been to some of the other places they say that are dumb. Memphis, like Kansas, North Carolina, Memphis, North Carolina. Kansas. I haven't been there. No okay, I okay. had that okay. style, Okay, but I ain't never had it from there. Okay. Yeah. But when it comes to barbecue, like, I got a array of places I can go to too in Texas to get some barbecue. If the right person is on the side of the road on Forest Lane, you can get some good barbecue. Hey, man, right shout out to, to my nigga Keith Terry, man. Yep. Shout out to my nigga Dallas, Keith Terry. He be, out there, he be out there in the north right there at Aldi's on Sundays and shit. Shout out yep. to my nigga Keith right Terry. Right in front of Aldi's. You can get some nigga. good food right there on the side of the street. But I'm the, but like, right in front of what? Aldi's. No, I'm saying how he said all these. With the S. <laughs> My bad. I, I ain't got no S at the end. It's some Chicago shit. I got that cousin. He had S to everything. Shit, the S's don't even belong. I'm going to Walmart's. Go shut up. Because <laughs> if you ain't going to more than one, why are you putting an excessive S on that shit? <laughs> Crazy, <laughs> that nigga made me so bro, the pause, the shit. pause niggas be doing some crazy <laughs> shit, bro. Man, I be like, bro, shit. what is wrong with you? Why do you have to talk that way? It's just like that be you. my whole thing with pause niggas. Like, bro, y'all can just be regular niggas yeah, if y'all want to be. Just talk like yeah, normal. Like, like, fuck is you doing all that? That's normal talk. That ain't no fucking. That's not normal. normal. It is normal talk for them because no, nobody else doing. Women don't. It ain't no different. It ain't no different than having an accent. That's their normal. It's pause niggas that. Sound like how we sound right and they now. They be trying oh, yeah, to do that shit, them. but then it's pause they niggas be trying that to be... get you drunk after the day and watch the fight. <laughs> Wait for you to fall asleep on their couch. I look, them the worst pause. I ain't never. I ain't I'd rather never, have right. extra S's than the hidden pause niggas. Yeah, that's dangerous. <laughs> you sleeping your pants down? Damn, you all right? You had a seizure. I don't remember having a seizure, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Why the fuck is my pants down? <laughs> I had a seizure. I left on my shirt and took off my pants. <laughs> That's what you're trying to tell. That nigga say, "Hey, sir, what's my <laughs> You prison, you fucking prison candidate. Get the oh, fuck out of here. <laughs> you're going to jail. Oh, you're going God. to jail. So oh, my God. God. You need to take that anesthesia and left my shirt and my socks on. <laughs> 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 nigga got his invisible in. Nigga said, "Yo, legs." He got a seizure. The only thing he came up was his pants. 
Sean, you are a rapist. Get out of here, you sick fuck. <laughs> I wonder what them niggas be thinking. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Oh, man. Uh, hey, them hidden uh, paws hey. niggas scary, bro. <laughs> hey, That's dog. a scary situation. That's what our parents was trying to protect us from. Them hidden paws niggas. <laughs> Especially in church. <laughs> oh, them the freakiest niggas. <laughs> People make like that shit is a white thing. <laughs> Black people just don't talk about it enough. Nigga, I got a Medea's big happy family. We got a situation <laughs> like that. And on Thanksgiving, we sitting here watching this shit. I'm telling them, I'm looking at my family like, these motherfuckers are sick. We are really watching this shit knowing that this person, his sister, is his mama. Knowing his sister is his mama, and that's what we sitting around watching for entertainment. It is crazy. You think it's crazy, it. man. Black people way sicker than white people with that shit. No hell no. White he people, could be the no, he could be the pastor of the church, and black people would catch the Holy Ghost under this nigga. White people will too. They probably do. They probably. Do. I don't know. No, I feel. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not racist. On. I'm not yeah. racist, but I feel like white people be doing the most extreme. Oh my god, this is. They are funny. extreme. They want to be shitted on. Like, so they, all that pussy. They you want, fucking you horses. You want to be defecated horses. on? Bro. That's what gets you going. Animal. But some animals people say they have so much power, and they used to so many yes things that they teeter tot on shit that should be no, and they find a person. So you telling so, me you ain't never did something with a chick just to see how far shit go? No. No, I'm only here for a short time, not a long time. I don't have time to experience. Tell, tell me what I you like. Focus. Let me know what you like, man. It be some other stuff you ain't doing with. Maybe not sexual, but French like toast what? is your favorite. I'm what? scared of what? your answer. Like <laughs> I'm like scared what? of no, your no, answer. I need an example, like what? I'm, I don't know. I don't have no example. Hold on. I'm Rick. just saying I know Rick. you done asked I feel like all some the, shit just to see how much I remember being a kid and nah, hearing and some straight sexual, killers. Hey. I mean straight killers talk about a woman blowing in their butt. And I know these niggas was killers. Blowing? But that's the shit they like. And I was like, why blowing? You like, do you like getting your nipple licked? Do I like getting my nipple licked? Nigga, in the act of sex, bitch, you can lick anything on me. I don't <laughs> give a fuck. As long as it ain't my ass, I'm turned on by everything. <laughs> <laughs> Physical touch is my second love language. So I knew he wasn't going to say me. no. When a nigga repeat the so question. you touch me. I like every age. Long as it ain't, it long as it ain't nothing incriminating, I don't give a damn. But somebody said the other day on Facebook that that's gay. For a man to let a woman lick their nipple, she riding my dick and she bend down and lick my nipple. You think I give a fuck about that nipple? Fuck that nipple. Bitch, right now, you can mute my whole goddamn body. I am focused on one thing and one thing only. <laughs> How you making this? <laughs> Man, nigga, shit, nigga, if you got time to wonder if some shit gay while you doing it, it ain't good enough to you yet. <laughs> mm. It ain't that's good a, enough to you yet. That's a fact, though. <laughs> you feel me? Now, that's some shit gonna happen that you gonna immediately your body is gonna respond and it's gonna go into a state of panic. Like, I had this older bitch. Put a chin on the bed. I thought she was gonna lick some nuts. Gave me three of the quickest tongue jabs to the ass. Before I knew it, my back was on my headboard. And my voice was so high pitched because I was in shock. Bitch, <laughs> what you so I was I was in shock. But then I had to come back and ask myself later, did I enjoy that? And I came up on no. I don't want it to happen again. I don't I can't remember the sensation of when it happened because my body went into a state of panic. Cause it's not supposed to be happening. And I'm like, bitch, I'm the ass you gonna eat. Like you don't even know my hygiene re regimen yet. I you probably just got nothing. the shitter. We, this our first date, and you wanna put your tongue in my ass on the first date? She a freak, bitch. You da no, that bitch ain't a freak. She's dangerous. Same, yeah. That bitch is dangerous. If you eating that men ass on the first date, you wild. Yeah, first date is crazy. Like you don't know what kind of trauma that nigga got. That nigga be done clenched and squeezed your head together and blew your brains out like on the boys or some type shit. This nigga funny as a <laughs> Like. You don't know what that man will do. He lock his knees together that quick on the side of your head, bitch. He'll give you vertigo. Bitch, <laughs> 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 give you this vertigo. You can't be playing with men like that. Oh, my God, bro. This can't play. You got to talk and disgust them kind of things. Listen, man. We got listen, strength listen, that man. we can't describe. Let's clap it up, man. Let's clap it up. Let's <laughs> Keep it, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
This nigga was big or top three, <laughs> top three guests for sure. So we gotta have you back for a part two. We gotta, oh, we gotta, we got, we got a lot more to discuss with you that we didn't get hey, to that's discuss. What we ain't talked about. Yeah, nah, we fuck, we we talked though. We talked. We, 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 hey, we got this. real vulnerable. Hey. Nigga talk about how they shit. <laughs> <laughs> we got vulnerable as fuck, man. Another round of applause <laughs> for black men opening up. Pause. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> but oh, uh, man, shout out to Reggie, man. Just Reggie. What's your Instagram? Yeah, Just Reggie. Man, Just Reggie. J U S S R E G G I E C O M E D Y. You got the wing, the food, the wings page. Right then, I couldn't fuck that up. You got the wings and shit. I got the wing page. Freaky what is it? Wings freaky wings. Two E's. Freaky wings. We ain't even talked about that. Well, that's why that's I said we got more to talk about. We gonna, we gonna say that. We gonna but say we gonna do yeah, a part freaky two. Freaky wings, man. man. Hit me up on that. I need there. to get some of them because I low key. I didn't, I've been seeing you post them, man. man. I, but I've been trying to find crazy. some good wings here. Angry behind wings, shit been bro. looking crazy. Yeah. Listen, every time Niggas, we ain't had angry. no good when wings. I posted yeah. Every time we seventy five dollars, people were telling me they relatives in like Arkansas and North Carolina. Like, damn, that's how y'all doing it. Ronnie Jordan did a voiceover to that shit. I put, I just made a video. I had eight wings and some fries, and put that they were seventy five dollars. Niggas went crazy. I have been called so many ungodly things. <laughs> Nigga call me Black Shrek, Nigga Shrek, <laughs> Negro Humpback, all oh, kind of fat fucks. Oh, they 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 tagged the FDA, they tagged the IRS. Oh, nigga, now if you try to cash at me, a message popped up that say I've been flagged for scamming. All because I put a little marketing scheme on some wings. Niggas who nigga in Nova Scotia reported me. You can't. Hey, no way possible. <laughs> you niggas just be angry, bro. Niggas be angry, bro. Listen, Freaky wings, well, bro. Two E's. If y'all catch this nigga in Snookies, please get them wings, bro. Most definitely, most definitely. Please get them. And he cooking them himself. Myself. Ain't nobody else back there cooking them. This nigga came from the back with the apron with the grit with the with the flour on that bitch. Man, bringing you that money. Bring it, oh, and he man. bring you the win. And he cooking them. Then he bringing them to you. Bring them to you in here. I still remember your flavor. You got a Come barbecue. Come on, man. Hell yeah. I asked for actual spicy barbecue. They was like, yeah, we don't make a mix. I was like, I said, I, I said, hey, I know Reggie. Fish. I said, I know Reggie, bro. I said, go get him. I say, I did like this. And you was like, I got you. Come I on, remember. Man. I don't know. It's Come in the knot, bro. Some all the it's important the shit. Come on. That's man. what I'm saying. People think get insecure about things, but you gotta really care. You don't know how I can bless you. One night I eat pussy for like I couldn't make this bitch clone for nothing. Close my mouth by accident, licked up between the missing two part, bitch nutted instantly. <laughs> I said, Who would you look at God? Never even knew. I never <laughs> even thought about it. I was just trying to breathe. Type shit. But I didn't want to stop, so the tongue just squeezed right between the little bitch's two parts. <laughs> bitch body went into convulsion. That bitch, bro, I, it blew my mind, bro. You never know. The thing you most insecure about might be your yeah, best nigga feature. Say I got a new trick for you, oh. Yeah, 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 man. This, this, this night bad. is like a good memory bank. All great shit started <laughs> happening to me when it came. Like, I just remembered shit. This nigga. Hey, y'all gotta be tuned in for the part two because we gotta get back to the history of this nigga Just Reggie. And we're gonna talk sure. about his wing cooking ordeal and all the other shit. But <laughs> man, this been a great one, man. School, what you got for the folk, man? I ain't got nothing. You ain't got shit for him? Yeah. Hey, man, make sure y'all tap in with the Instagram. But for shit, sure, I'm always gonna say that because whatever. Follow the Facebook page. Share, like, subscribe. That shit free. Make sure y'all follow, share, like, subscribe. Oh, my man, Just Reggie's a hilarious nigga. Before we even got on camera, the nigga had us crying, laughing, and this whole instantly. You feel man, me? Man, talking about just, the homeless army. Just... <laughs> can, can we real quick tell him, like, we got to stop trying to fight white people with guns. And people are privileged with guns. Just a million men stop taking baths for one month. Fight them with dirt. <laughs> it makes them so uncomfortable. I can see myself, bro. You can get your army of 50 homeless niggas walking to Walmart and just start <laughs> licking and touching everything. They got to throw that shit away. They can't serve it to the public. You would fuck up the economy. Homeless people got a power they don't even know they have. 
Hey, that's we been is. fighting with guns. We should have been fighting with dirt. That's why they don't be letting them in the stores and shit. <laughs> Bro, how you gonna stop 50 of them? No bullshit, though. <laughs> Six you, homeless niggas. You in don't even want to touch them. Taking a shower in the sink. You can't don't go back in that touch bathroom me, without the ERC not going in there. <laughs> like, homeless people got a superpower. They really don't know. They, it, it's so profound. That's Fight funny. them with dirt. That is funny That's as funny fuck, bro. Fight them with dirt. Hey, Put them yeah. down. Man. Put them down. We're going to fire them with dirt. Hey, man. Make sure y'all follow the YouTube. <laughs> like, share, subscribe, ring that bell on the YouTube. I always yeah, say, man, crazy. it's free to show love. That's it. They don't take no subscribing. I mean, they don't take no giving no money or nothing like that. If you fuck with us, fuck with us. And if we fuck with you, we fuck with you. If you fuck with us, we fuck with us even harder. We gonna fuck with y'all back. But for sure, for sure, this shit is free. It don't take nothing but two seconds to click some shit if you fuck with us. Spread the word to your family if you fuck with us on the same time. If they on Instagram, we got Instagram. If they on Facebook, we got Facebook. If they on YouTube, we got YouTube. You feel what I'm saying? But show us some love. Show Reggie some love. And we out this bitch. And if they don't eat gravy and drink tea, fuck them. Fuck them. <laughs> 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 <laughs>